hear the word of the living God. Reject every sickness. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and declare that loud and clear. In Jesus' name we pray. Father, we thank you for another wonderful evening before you. I will praise the holy name because you are the God of righteousness and power. We thank you because of the mightiness of your name and your power. And we thank you because you are the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. Him who was, who is, and who is to come. Accept our thanks in Jesus' name. This evening, open our understanding. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Tonight, by the grace of God, we are starting a new teaching series called What is Divine Protection? What is Divine Protection? You will do well to listen to these lectures, attend regularly. You will certainly need these teachings as you go on with life and even one day. The more of defense scripture you memorize, the better for you. Psalm 71 verse 3. Can we read it together loud and clear? Let's go. Thy strong habitation, where to I may continually restore. Thou hast given commandment to save me, for thou art my rock and my foot. Read it again loud and clear. Be thou my strong habitation, whereunto I may continually resort. Thou hast given commandment to save me, for thou art my rock and my fortress. Read it again loud and clear. <laughs> thou hast given commandment to save me. It is no matter the terrible situation. If you understand the principle of divine protection, He will give commandment to save you. Psalm 91. Psalm 91. Let's read it from verse 1 to the last verse. Psalm 91. Are you ready? Let's go. Shall deliver thee from the snow of the fowler, from the noisome pestilence. Shall cover thee with his feather, and under his wings shall thou trust. His truth shall be thy shield and buckler. is a psalm of divine protection. And one very great thing you can do for your destiny and for your life is to memorize that psalm. At any time you want to go into a situation, confess it loud and clear. The first verse says, He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall then abide under the shadow of of the Almighty. Bow down your heads. Pray this prayer loud and clear for yourself. Any power assigned to remove me from under the shadow of the Almighty. In the name of Jesus. Any power signed to remove me from under that shadow of the Almighty. Command the power to die. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 
look at the introduction. The enemy is now operating an uncommon rage, spreading death and destruction to mankind. All you need to do is to buy a newspaper, begin to open, you find it rage of the enemy spread through the pages of the newspapers. Life is becoming increasingly unsafe, even in the ether, the safe environment. Divine protection is therefore of utmost importance. As a matter of utmost necessity, we must learn the principles of divine protection. All believers must be aware of what is meant by spiritual attack, so that if you attack spiritually, you won't start taking injection. Because spiritual attacks don't respond to hospital injections. Spiritual defense, spiritual immunity, spiritual barricade, spiritual protection. The Lord our God is the only true security. The Bible talks about believers being the apple of the eye of the Almighty, Zechariah 2 8. It also tells that our God forms the edge of fire around us, Zechariah 2 5. Meaning that if you are the apple of the eye of God, anybody who wants to touch you, the first thing he wants to touch is to put his hands into the eye of God. Or he wants to penetrate the fire. The Bible tells us that believers are under the shadow of his wings. God the Almighty has committed himself to keeping his people safe. The Almighty has promised his people divine immunity and divine insurance. In conclusion, the Almighty has the best insurance policy. There is a serious battle going on now. The battle is getting increasingly fierce and terrible. A lot of people are being wasted. And many die at the prime of their age. A visit to the cemetery of Moshari will convince of that one. What's protection? Protection is to cover. To offer asylum. Or to offer shelter. Protection is to offer refuge. To immunize somebody against a particular thing. To serve as a buffer. To insulate and to safeguard. To secure. To provide security and to preserve. To shield. And to ward off attackers. To offer insurance and to guard. All those 15 things are the meaning of what we call protection. What have we said so far? There is a serious battle going on. And one of the first principles of warfare is self-preservation. It is only when you are alive that they call you first lady, second lady, third lady. It's then they call you honorable this, Mr. This, Professor, that, Dr. That is when you are alive they call you. You need to understand that the first principle is self-preservation. You need to know where our protection is coming from. I remember my friend a long time ago who had a big house and he got one mega who had a terrible juju on his neck to be guarding the house. He told me that one night he was watching television and the mega dancer said, Oh God, oh God, oh God, you're on your own, oh. you're on your own. Hey, do you understand what the man was saying? By the time he looked downstairs, the old building was surrounded by armed robbers and the mega was one of them. He too had his own gun. So my friend knew that he was on his own, true, true. I also had another friend that got some the guard to guard his house. Chiefs came in, they stole, they took things away. In the morning, do you know what the Megad was saying? See, and I was dreaming of chiefs, so. I was dreaming of chiefs. Yeah, I was a man who was supposed to stay awake. Now he's talking about dreaming of chiefs. At the end of the day, the ultimate security is the Lord our God. The ultimate security is the power of God. You can read all kinds of books, how to fight Kalate, how to fight Judo, how to use knife, how to use this. The ultimate security is still the power of God. And we need to understand the principle of that power. One woman wanted to go out one day, something said, go back inside. And say, I cover myself with the blood of Jesus. So she obeyed. Went inside. I cover myself with the blood of Jesus. She went out. On the way, they will lay that car. Captured her. Tied her. Put her in the boot of that car. And drove off. 
like that. And this vehicle was going. They passed the first police checkpoint. The man just held the police. Hey, oh, see, how are you? How is everything? They gave him some money. He said, go, 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 go. The woman was at the back. They got another checkpoint. I said, oh, see, oh, see, oh, see. But that day, they also said, no, wait. They brought up and said, no, I don't want money. Open your boot. That's how that woman who covered herself with the blood was delivered. Perhaps what will have happened will have been apart from losing her car, they will cut the pieces of her body on the front of one idol. It is an insult on your salvation for a kidnapper to use magic power to kidnap a Christian. It's an insult on your salvation. And that kind of thing is even common now. Because anyone who is under the shadow of the Almighty, the enemy will be afraid of you. Kinds of protection. There are three major kinds of protection. There is protection by divine power. That's what God did for Joseph in the Bible. He did for David. He did it for Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego by releasing them from the fire. He did it for Peter, who was released from prison. He did it for Paul. There is protection by divine power. Then there is protection by satanic technology. This kind of protection is what some people go and start looking for now. A man bought a car. He put a cross by the mirror. He said that one is Christian insurance. Then he did this phylactery, tira. Put that by the gear. So that one is Islamic protection. He now had some powerful juju again. He put them under the seat. So this one is local protection. All because he was afraid and he didn't want the car stolen. But when the enemy would strike, he himself drove the same vehicle under a trailer. The combined insurance that he thought he had which, as far as everyone is concerned, is just satanic technology. Did not help him at all. When you go for satanic protection, there are problems. You become a satanic Christmas goat. Because the devil who kept you alive and protected you will come back one day and say, Well, that was the day I protected you. Now you are my meat. That's the first disadvantage. The second disadvantage. That if you use satanic technology, you are gambling with wickedly intelligent spirits whose sole aim is to destroy. If you practice satanic technology for defense, the third disadvantage is that you are warming yourself in the fire of the enemy and they will strike back one day. If you practice that technology, you are feeding the enemy so much that the enemy will be strong to fight you another time. Because it's true that if witch doctors don't have customers who come to them, they will look for another job. When you practice the talent technology, you become double the child of hellfire. These are the disadvantages. Another disadvantage is that you just trade off your soul to wicked spirits. Another disadvantage is that you may be forming a covenant with your life. And this will eventually backfire. So at the end of the day, God is the ultimate security. God is the ultimate security. The third security is protection by man. You can employ police, you can employ all kinds of things. But at the end of the day, the Bible says, except the Lord keep the house, the labor in vain that keep it. You can employ security people to put guns and surround you. But all you need to die is for just one mosquito to bite you. And malaria starts. Are you putting chloroquine? Malaria says no. Putting another room, Malaria says no. So at the end of the day, the ultimate protection is the Lord Almighty. Many years ago, I knew somebody who protected his house by buying a parrot. Bought a parrot put it in the house. One day, thieves came to the house and they took his things away. By the time he came, the parrot said, Oh God, Sunday, came here, Sunday, Sunday came here. And by the time he rushed to Sunday's house, they were just sharing his things. And police arrested Sunday. And he got his things back. The man was very happy. 
He gave the parrot a double portion of food to eat. But the second time the thieves came, the thieves came again. The thieves did not make a mistake this time. They stole the parrot itself. So there was no mistake this time. So there was nobody to tell him what had come. Ultimate protection is from the King of Kings and is from the Lord of Lords. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. In Psalm 34 verse 7, Psalm 34 verse 7, Psalm 34 verse 7 says this, The angel of the Lord encampeth round about them that fear him and delivereth them. God uses his angels for divine protection. Can you say this after me? The angel of the Lord encampeth round about them that fear him and delivered them. That's Psalm 34 verse 7. God uses his angels as agents of protection. Point number two, they say God does not withhold protection from his people. In Psalm 84 verse 11, Psalm 84 11 says, For the Lord God is a sun and a shield, the Lord will give grace and glory. No good thing will he withhold from them that walk uprightly. For the Lord God is a sun and a shield, the Lord will give grace and glory. No good thing will he withhold from them that walketh uprightly. I pray that the Lord will now withhold his protection from you in the name of Jesus. Point three says, a believer can claim long life and prosperity. You can claim it. Look at what it says in Psalm 90 verse 10. Psalm 90 verse 10 says, The days of our years are three score years and ten. And if by reason of strength they be four score years, yet is their strength, labor, and sorrow, for it is soon cut off and will fly away. You can claim long life and prosperity. Four. God promises to shield his people from evil and plagues. In Psalm 91 verse 10, So there shall no evil before thee, neither shall any plague come nigh thy dwelling. God promises to shield us from evil and plague. Whether there is an infection or a disease going all over the place, he has promised to protect us. In the same Psalm 91 verse 11 to 12, he said, For he shall give his angels charge over thee, to keep thee in all thy ways. They shall bear thee up in their hands, lest thou dash thy foot against a stone. He's telling us, according to point number five there, that it will keep our feet from stumbling and from falling. In Psalm 115 verse 11, the Lord promises to help and shield his people. Then, in Psalm 121 verse 7, the Lord promises to preserve us from all evil. In Psalm 127 verse 1, it said divine protection is indispensable. Except the Lord keep the eyes of labor in vain and watch. When the banana said divine protection is unfailing. When 10 said the Lord promises to preserve our ways. When 11 said the Lord promises to protect us by wisdom, knowledge, discretion, and understanding. 12 he said the Lord promises to prolong our days. According to Proverbs 3. Then 13, divine protection promises us during sleep. When we sleep, it will protect us. Look at Proverbs chapter 3, Proverbs 3, verse 24. When thou liest down, thou shalt not be afraid. Yea, thou shalt lie down, and thy sleep shall be sweet. If you are having trouble sleeping, go and memorize that verse and begin to confess and confess it. 14. The law of God and keeping his commandments will give us long life and peace. Look at Proverbs 14. Say, Hear, O my son, and receive my sayings, and the years of thy life shall be many. Shall be many. In Proverbs 9 11, multiplication of years is promised. In Proverbs 10 27, the fear of the Lord prolongs life. And 17 is very interesting. Said the righteous is delivered from trouble, and the wicked is used in substitution. In Proverbs 11:8, that is when evil is about to take place, 
a divine substitution takes place and the Lord moves out his people and moves in others to replace them. That's what the Bible says will happen. Say, God is ready to give life for your life and give life for your sake. Remember, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego walked out of the fire. But those who went to throw them in died. Daniel walked out alive from that lion's den. But a divine substitution took place. 18. Wholesome words can preserve life. Proverbs 14, 3. 19. Trusting in God preserves life. Proverbs 35. Then immunity against satanic weapon and satanic tongue is promised. Says every tongue that rises against you in judgment, thou shalt condemn. That's what Isaiah 54, 17 is saying. 21. Believers have the power to trample on all powers of darkness in all their ramifications. Whatever they are, we have the power to trample upon them. 22. The high priest prayer prayed for us by Jesus includes protection from evil in John chapter 17, 15 and 20. The second Thessalonians 3, deliverance from the wicked man is promised. Second Timothy 4, 17 to 18, deliverance from the mouth of the lion is promised. All these passages, and all these 24 points, is to tell you that the ultimate protection comes from the Lord Almighty. Those who are qualified for divine protection are those who are to the voice of the Lord, those who completely repent, those who are perfect in their hearts, those who are humble in their hearts, those who run to God for help, the church of God as a whole, and the saints of God. So as far as you are a born again child of God, you are qualified for divine protection. Now we go to the seven walls of protection. There are seven walls, spiritual walls, that God used to protect his people. The first one is the wall of fire. What is the first one, beloved? In Zechariah chapter 2, verse 5. Zechariah, second to the last book in the Old Testament. Zechariah 2, 5. For I said the Lord, will be unto her a wall of fire round about, and will be the glory in the midst of her. One wall the Lord builds around the people is the wall of fire. And when that wall of fire is surrounding you, you become a terror in the camp of the enemy. It reminds me of that brother that was living in one room, and he didn't even know that the next room to him belonged to a native doctor. And every night this man would project into his room and want to harm the brother. But every night the man went there, he would see this halo of fire surrounding the brother and moving fast around him. And he couldn't get access to this brother. He would worry the man. Because he has been taught that he had a great power, that no power is beyond their own. But he didn't understand this fire that he could not penetrate. So he had to confront the brother. So, who are you? That one didn't understand the question. As I am brother Rufus. I said, no. That's not the question. Who are you? I said, what's the problem? He said, I've been coming to your room for the past three months, every day. But there is this halo of fire around you that I cannot penetrate. I pray that any power that wants to remove the fire of God surrounding you shall be disgraced in the name of Jesus. Say, so I receive the wall of fire around my life, around my family. I receive the wall of fire around my life, around my family, in the name of Jesus. Say it three hot signs. The wall of fire. If God opens our eyes and we see the benefit we have in Christ, and we also see these evil forces surrounding us, many of us will now understand why the pastor keeps saying, Depart from sin, depart from sin, be holy, 
Be righteous. Be holy. Be righteous. Be prayerful. The reason for those messages will be clear. Some believers were going in the desert. They didn't know that some robbers were following them. They did not know at all. And these robbers followed and followed and followed them. Every night these believers will gather and pray. And they just sleep. Not knowing that these people have been following them every night. These robbers, whenever they move close to the camp of these believers, they find this tall wall of fire burning. And they cannot understand it. But one particular night, they found that although the wall of fire was there, it wasn't burning very high in some areas. It was through that wall, they now jumped inside and woke them up. I said, gentlemen, we have been following you for weeks. What have you been doing for weeks that you did not do today? Because for the first time, we found a way of jumping inside. It was then those believers knelt down and began to ask for forgiveness because that was the only night they forgot to pray. I pray that whatsoever will remove that wall of fire from you will be destroyed in the name of Jesus. The second wall is in Psalm 34 verse 7, which we have read before. Let's read it again. Psalm 34 verse 7. This is the second wall. The angel of the Lord encamped round about them that fear him and delivered them. Delivered them. So the second one of protection that God gives to us as believers is the wall of his angels. The angel of the Lord encamped round about those that fear him. As they form a wall around you. Trouble comes. When we begin to practice and do things that are unholy. Things that will chase the angels of the living God away. Trouble comes when we go to locations where the Almighty does not want us to go. The angels of God, they encamp around these people to deliver them. I pray that that wall of angels will surround your life always. To surround your life always in the name of Jesus. Remember a brother who went to minister in a crusade. And God moved in wonders in that crusade. It was a three-day crusade. Day one, plenty of things happened. Many who were into mass courage were doing all kinds of things, surrendered their powers. And the chief priests were angry. Second day, they brought all kinds of things to the crusade. And they were firing arrows at the man of God at the altar. But they found that nothing went wrong with him. Nothing went wrong with him. So they did not turn physical. So the third day, they waited. The plan was that immediately he shared the grace on the third day. They would just rush to the front, one accord, and cut him to pieces. That was the game plan. As the crusade ended on the third day, the man of God said, let us share the grace in fellowship. As they said, may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. From the back, these three hefty men just came. Muscular. They wore only pants. They were shoulder higher than everybody on the crusade. They just walked straight to the altar. And pick up the man of God like paper. And lifted him like this upon their head. He was struggling with them too. But they just took him away. And the villagers who came to fight were happy. Said, huh? We didn't know he as if we not some other people. These three giant men took him outside the village. Into a pathway in a bush. And they set him down. And they said go your way. And by the time we look back, they had vanished. It was then he discovered that he had been rescued by the angels of the living God. This is why, beloved, you should not do anything that you wouldn't like anybody to read in the pulpit that you are doing. Because those things, anything you are doing that you are ashamed that others will hear, will chase the angels of God away from you. These are the facts of the case. The third wall is in Proverbs 18.10. Proverbs 18.10 The third wall is the wall of his name. Proverbs 18.10 says The name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run it into it and is safe. Can you read that verse loud and clear? Shout it again loud and clear. Can you shout it again loud and clear? (laughs) 
Some of you might have heard me sharing this testimony before. It happened in Nigeria here. This man was in group seven in the occultic world and a blood drinker. And the way they drink blood is to enter into a passenger's vehicle at a particular place, they cause accident, everybody will die, blood will flow, and he will collect his blood. This blood drinker man has three vehicles at home, three posh cars at home. But he now went to the public garage, motor park, and this bus packed full with people. Took the bus. Fortunately or unfortunately, a brother to enter the bus. As the bus was about to start moving, the brother cleared his throat. <coughs> Let us pray. And he prayed. Commit this vehicle into the hands of the Lord. In the name of Jesus. And everybody, even including Muslims, they said amen. And the vehicle moved. At the point where the accident was supposed to happen, the man did everything he ought to do to make that vehicle some assault. The vehicle just went. No problem. And he got to the next city. The man was annoyed and surprised. Because it had never happened before. He, he didn't give up. He entered a vehicle that was going from that city to another one. Fortunately or unfortunately, the same brother too entered that vehicle. The vehicle was full. Again, <coughs> he cleared his throat. Let us pray. He prayed again. Again, the man tried to cause accident. He did not succeed. Quickly, he constructed his oracles. And they pointed to that was that man. That man that is praying in the name of that great one. The one that is making you not to see blood to drink now. Okay, he didn't give up to. When they got to the second city, he took another vehicle again. Fortunately or unfortunately, the brother to enter the same vehicle. Meanwhile, the brother did not know that he was being watched. He had no clue of what was going on. He was just praying his prayers. As the vehicle was full again, and we were about to move off, <laughs> let us pray. At that level, the man said, no, 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 no. Ah, this, this country is a free country, freedom of religion. You have no right to pray in this place. You can't impose your religion upon us. This is a free country. Let this vehicle go. You have no right to pray. Ah, so you know Nigerians. And I say, ah, Mr. Man, what's your problem? This is very simple. Let him pray his prayer. Then you too, pray your prayer. All of us will say amen. And we go. So what? What's your problem? I say, oh, come Mr. Man, pray your prayer, yo. And he prayed again. And the accident did not happen. When they got to the final bus stop, they now pursued the brother. So what power do you have? Was for the first time the brother knew that he was really in danger. But it is written, the name of the Lord is a strong power. Shout it loud and clear. Shout it again loud and clear. The righteous run it into it and is safe. The fourth wall is the wall you find in Psalm 91 verse 1. Psalm 91 verse 1. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. The wall of his shadow. The shadow of the Almighty. Once you dwell under that shadow, it's like a wall around you and the enemy cannot come close to your life. The fifth wall you find in Psalm 91 verse 4. He shall cover thee with his words, feather, and under his wings shall thou trust. His truth shall be thy shield and buckler. There is a wall of his wings. As you dwell under his wings, it will cover you day and night. And whether you go by road or by air, by whatever journey you travel, the wall of his wings is enough to protect you. The sixth wall, Psalm 125, from 1 to 3. Psalm 125, verse 1. They that trust in the Lord shall be as Mount Zion, which cannot be removed but abided forever. As the mountains are round about Jerusalem, so the Lord is round about his people. The Lord himself is round about his people. 
from henceforth even forever. For the rod of the wicked shall not rest upon the lot of the righteous, lest the righteous put forth their hands into iniquity. So there is a wall of his presence. Wall of his presence. Said as the mountains are round about Jerusalem in one twenty five verse two, so the Lord is round about his people. The wall of his presence. The wall of his presence. The seventh wall is the wall of the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus is the ever efficacious power to protect his people. Those are the seven walls the Lord uses to surround his people. When we say divine protection, protection from war, here you see 14 things that the Almighty protects us from. Number one, from evil. Number two, it keeps us from falling. Number three, it keeps us in the way we follow. Four, it keeps us from temptation. Five, it provides a refuge for us. Six, it defends us against our enemies. Seven, it defeats the counsels of our enemy. Eight, it rescues us from temptation. Nine, it delivers us from persecution. It protects us from calamities. It protects us from all dangers. It is with us in all places. That thing, it protects us in our sleep. And then it protects us from death. Those are the 14 major things that the divine protection of the Almighty protects us from. So in a nutshell, beloved, divine protection is the ultimate protection which comes from dwelling in the secret place of the Most High. And when He protects you, He covers you, He provides you refuge, He insulates you, He provides you with security, He gives you a shield, and He becomes your buckler. The Lord will protect you and your family in the name of Jesus. Amen. I thank God for those of you who surrender your life to Jesus Christ in this program. God bless you in Jesus' name. You've taken the most important decision in life, and I rejoice with you. For more information, counseling, and prayers, kindly send your name, your address, your telephone number to the WhatsApp number displayed on the screen. You can also send us an email. The email address is also displayed on the screen. And we shall be getting across to you shortly. God bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. I want you to pray the following prayers. It is very sad and very wicked when people gather while you are asleep to begin to summon you for destruction. The following prayers I want you to pray is to dismantle any satanic technology against your safety. Is to dismantle any power lighting candles against you or incanting against your name. Shout this now loud and clear. Every witchcraft agenda for my life. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Begin to scatter the agenda now. In Jesus' name we pray. Any power calling my name from the demonic kingdom. You are a liar. There. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to declare it. Yes. Jesus' name we pray. Every satanic mirror calling for my face, disgrace your owner. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray like that. Masatala kaya boshengeraba. Just in Jesus' name we pray. The only God said we should pray this 
next prayer three hot times. He says he wants to do something through it. And I'm going to just obey that instruction now. Any power power. using my placenta against me. (laughs) In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and declare it loud and clear. Something is up over there. That star be released. Be released. Be released. Be released. In Jesus' name we pray. Open your mouth and pray the second time. Deal with that power. In Jesus' name we pray. Let there be silence. There are five persons that this is really connected to. Within the next few seconds, the power of God will hit them right there where they are. And the yoke that that placenta has brought into your life, because it's in the wrong hands, the yoke shall be broken to pieces. That's number one. That's number two. That's number three. Number four. That's right. They have been controlling your life using this material. Be released. Be released. Be released. Be released. Be released. Be set free. Aha. There must be a release. That's number five. Thank you, Jesus. Every power. Using my placenta against me. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. Deal with that power. In Jesus' name we pray. To make impact. I believe God. And those who are present tonight. And those who have determined. That they must make impact. Amen. Right from the beginning of the Bible. To the end of it. Listen to me well. God has never been interested in majority. God has always worked with the minority. Thousands and millions of people were in the world during the time of Noah. He only took about seven or eight people out. The rest gone. Minority. Three million people left the land of Egypt. Boys and girls... Male and female, what at the end of the day, <laughs> cross over to the promised land, minority. So, from the beginning of the things of God, selected few have always been the one who will carry his purpose forward. After Jesus administered for three and a half years, when he was going away, he gathered 120, 120. And those were the ones enough to turn the world upside down. I'm praying for somebody that the power for you to impact your generation and thereby rewrite your family history will come upon you now in the name of Jesus. A seven for the man. What is impact? And that takes us to Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 13. Let's open our Bibles to Deuteronomy 28, verse 13. Or let's pick it from 12. The Lord shall open unto thee his good treasure. The heaven to give the rain unto thy land in his season. And to bless all the work of thy hand. And thou shalt lend unto many nations. And thou shalt not borrow. And the Lord shall make thee head and not the tail. And thou shalt be above only. 
and thou shalt not be beneath. <laughs> if that thou hearken unto the commandments of the Lord thy God, which I command thee this day to observe and to do them. Life is a one way street, and everyone is important in God's plan in this world. The harvest indeed is plenty, but the laborers are still very few. God has deposited anointing, gifts, talents, investments in your life. It is therefore very important for our lives to be lived in such a way as to influence others positively. Let's read that sentence again. It is therefore very important for our lives to be lived in such a way as to influence others positively. You need to become a man or woman of positive impact. You need to become a man or woman of positive impact. This is a serious issue. Thousands, thousands and thousands die every day. Nobody even knows that they have gone. A lot of terrible things happen. Nobody cares sometimes whether they happen or they don't happen. The thing is this. When you die and you leave this earth, what will men say about you after you are gone? We could carry the coffin and head towards the burial ground and begin to sing, Whereas the man did not go anywhere. He had lived a useless life while here. A life that had not made any impact. We've seen some situation. A person dies and people cry. They cry. You beg them, it is enough. But they refuse to be pacified. It is because of the impact those ones have made. I've seen a situation too. When an old person died and everybody in the streets came out rejoicing. But that wicked man is gone. That wicked man is gone. And they were rejoicing. Because when this man was alive, if you pass at the front of his house and you don't prostrate or you don't kneel down, he will arrest your leg with his wicked power. And you have to pass at the front of his house or go everywhere. So he had made an impact, but a negative impact. The reason we don't find some people coming to church is because the impact Christians are making in the environment is low. Some are actually making negative impact. Some will tell you, you are inviting me to church. Show me the name of the church. Then they say, say ah, ah, one of your members is coming to sleep with a married woman here. So, is that the kind of church I'm inviting me to? So, those ones are making negative impact. They say, come to our church. Say, if your church is the only church that remains with your kind of life that I'm seeing, I will not follow you there. That is negative impact. I'm praying for you that you will not be a negative example. <laughs> Let that amen be louder than that. So, when you leave this planet, Will they see your footprints on the sand of time? Will they say you have made an impact? Will they say you are important? If you are a man of God, will they say a prophet has passed through this place? Will they say a kind woman has passed through this place? A good person has passed through this place? Will they rejoice that you are gone? Or will they be unhappy that you are gone? Sometimes when you see people going to the cemetery, it's easy to know whether the person they are going to bury is important or not important. When you see them carrying a coffin to the cemetery, and those who are burying the person they are smoking cigarettes, they are smoking cigarettes, they are eating chewing gum, they are not singing, they are not dancing, they are just going there blankly. You know that that person has not made any impact. I decree upon your life that the anointed of the impact maker will come upon you in the name of Jesus. <laughs> By the time the great apostle Joseph Babarala died, the demons gathered together. 
they did a thanksgiving service that this man has gone. The troubler of our lives. His life troubled the enemy. Not the enemy troubling his life. So you need to make up your mind. Are you going to be an impact maker? Or are you going to come to this water just mark time? It's a decision you need to make. And let me tell you one key statement which you must never forget in this introduction I'm making. If nobody is learning anything good from you, if nobody is learning anything good from you, you are living a wasted life. That's the truth. If nobody is learning something good from you, then you have come to live a wasted life. It is time for many of us to wake up from the slumber in which the enemy has put us. It is time for you to wake up that giant, the inner lion in you, that has been sleeping. It's time to wake it up so that they can move forward and make impact. Can you raise up your right hand to the heavens and shout this on your own head? Daniel! What? slumber of darkness. Wake yourself up from the slumber of darkness. Makapata satiala. In Jesus name we pray. In life, there are ten categories of people. One, those who never discover who they are. Those who never discover who they are. That's group number one. They are millionaires, but they don't know they are millionaires. They are intelligent. They don't know their intelligence. They are supposed to be prophets, but they don't know. They are supposed to be lecturers. They simply do not know. There are many blind people like that in our world who don't know who they are. Here is this woman created as an elephant. Now she wants to marry. Because she did not know that she's an elephant. She decided to marry a cockroach. And so that kind of marriage will not work. Because she had not discovered who she is. And this is a great problem indeed. Even in the Bible you can see it working out sometimes. Somebody like Moses. Originally did not know who he was. He was in the desert. Looking after animals. Looking after cattle. Imagine. The man looking after cattle wrote the first books of the Bible. All these first books of the Bible were inside his tummy. But he was in the desert looking after animals. May you not die with your divine potential. May it manifest. 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 In the name of Jesus. Look at Paul. Paul was busy running and killing Christians. When he didn't know who he was, he was killing them. The man killing the Christians, two third of the New Testament was inside his belly. And yet he was working against it because he did not know who he was. It's a terrible tragedy when you don't know who you are. So one great question that you need to answer, and the earlier you answer, the better. It is, who are you? Who are you? Who are you? They came to John the Baptist. They said, Who are you? Are you Elijah the prophet? I am not. Are you the Messiah? I am not. Are you that prophet? I am not. But who are you? 
You should have expected the man to say, You don't know me. Ah, uh-uh. are you new in this place? You don't know me. They are asking for my identity. My father was Zechariah the priest. My mother was Elizabeth. Ah, uh-uh. the angel professor my birth. He didn't say all that. So who are you? He said, I am the voice of him cry in the wilderness. Make straight the paths of the Lord. Make his way straight. Every valley shall be exalted. Every mountain shall be brought low. Say, I am a voice. I am a voice. May the Lord make you a voice. <laughs> Two. Those who do not know what is happening, they are just in this world, they are just looking. Everything is just happening around them. They have no clue what is happening. Three. Those who watch things happening, they are just spectators. People are receiving the baptism of the Holy Ghost. They are just spectating. People are receiving miracles. They are just spectating. May you not be that kind of spectator. Four. Those who make things happen, they make things happen. When they say church, there are some people, they make church happen. Some are not concerned. They are not concerned. They are just floaters. They float in and float out. They see benches, they don't know who clean them. They don't know who sweeps the place. They are not interested. They just watch things happen. But there are those who make things happen. Five. They are strugglers and wrestlers. They are just surviving. No breakthrough. Six. There are those who are nothing. Zero. They do nothing. They attempt nothing. They know nothing. Seven. There are those who have, but it's not enough. Poverty level. Eight. There are those who have just enough. They can only feed their own mouth. They can't feed another mouth. Nine. There are those who are successful. They have enough. Ten. There are those who are significant. That is, they have more than enough and they can impact others positively. Can impact others positively. What is impact? The dictionary defines impact as a forceful effect. To make an effect. Two, is effect that gives color. Three, is highest notable impression of something. Four, highest number that can be attained. Five, is creating positive effect with one's life. Your life is making positive effects. Six, is living indelible mark in the lives of people. Seven, is being a force to reckon with and not a mediocre. Eight, is being a source of change, turnaround and transformation. Nine, is making notable impression upon people's heart and mind. The bottom line is this. Impact is influencing others positively. They look at your life, they follow your life, and it makes a positive impact. A positive impact. That songwriter says, Some have friends who do them evil, but they have failed to make Jesus their friend. They have friends who are impacting them negatively, but they fail to make Jesus their friend. I'm praying one more time that the anointing of the impact maker will come upon your life in the name of Jesus. Let that amen roar like thunder. It's so it's important for your life to make impact. It's important for people to look at you and say, yes, we thank God that you are here. We thank God because of you we could do this. That I didn't know how to do this before, but you taught me and now I can do it. What impact are you making now with your life? What impact are you making with the way you talk, with the way you relate to people? Have you made an impact enough for people to say, oh, you don't need to preach to us, we shall follow you to your church, we can see your lifestyle. Say, your life is a textbook that we've all read, and we're willing to follow you anywhere. In that house where you are living, can they say, your life has made impact. 
I remember one of my fathers in the Lord many years ago. He said when he got married, they were always fighting. Fighting with wife, fighting with wife. After some time, he got a visitor one day. The visitor was their landlord. The landlord was a Muslim, an Elijah man. The landlord knocked their door and got inside and said, Oga, you people go to church every day here. We hear you pray here. Sometimes you speak some language that we too don't even understand. But then you also fight. So since you are praying and you are fighting, is this what they are teaching you in your church? That you pray and fight, you pray and fight, you pray and fight. That man said, after this landlord has spoken to him, it was as if somebody poured cold water on his head. So in a sense, the landlord was saying, you are not making a positive impact here. Your impact here is completely negative. And that was a word of wisdom for the wise. He quickly recovered himself. He quickly repaired his ways. And he quickly began to move in his way. The way of the Lord. I pray one more time that the anointing for a life that will make positive impact will come upon your life in the name of Jesus. Why must you make impact? He says you are very important to God's plan in this world. God does not waste time. God does not practice useless exercise. God has an agenda for every life he has created. God has a plan for every life that he has created. God has a specific plan for you even as a citizen there. You are completely unique. There is no two persons like you. God created you to come and carry out an assignment. He has a specific duty for you. God does not just do things without thinking. You are here for a purpose. You are here for an assignment. That's why you must make impact. You must make impact because the harvest is plenteous. And laborers are few. Plenty of harvest. Few laborers. Few laborers. Even if we have one million evangelists, it's not even enough to reach the world. Our verse is plenty. Libras are few. You need to make impact because you can still do much more than you are doing now. You need to make impact because God has deposited anointing, gifts, and investment in your life. That's what somebody has said that the most valuable place on earth is the cemetery. Because in that cemetery lies song that never saw the light of the day. Inventions that never came out. Dreams that died. Stories that died. Ambition that died. Ministration that died. Right there in that cemetery. They call the place the richest place on earth. Jesus said, Ye are the light of the world. And when you light the light, you don't put it under bushes. He said, the house built on the hill cannot be hid. But the impact we need to make is the reason for all those statements about you are the salt of the earth, you are the light of the world, is because God is saying, make an impact. No matter how dark a place is now, if we bring in just a small candle, that small candle that you just lighted, in that darkness will make an impact. So you are the light of the world and the salt of the earth. You need to make impact because our God is not a mediocre. It's not a minimum God. You need to make an impact. Your impact here on earth determines your reward in heaven. You have to make an impact because God wants you to be a voice and not an echo. God wants you to be a contributor and not a consumer. You will certainly be remembered by the impact you make. And it is when you make impact, men can say that, yes, you have passed through this place. It is important as believers, and as Christians who want to make heaven, and as those who want to influence others, that we should strategically plan that our lives 
wherever we land, we make a positive impact. And it shall be so in the name of Jesus. <laughs> Add facts about impact. So impact means to influence or to have strong effect on people or situation. Impact is the ability to use your potential, talent, competent capability and influence to rule your world, people and situation. We are all called to impact our world and everyone has something to give. Many have lived and died without making impact because they did not know how to use their God-given talents to impact the world. Impact is unmistakable, undeniable, significant, a major effect on our environmental generation as a result of our existence. Your impact is a combination of the things that happen around you just because you exist. You are an asset or a liability, a burden bearer or a burden to others, a solution to people's problem or you are a problem yourself. It says you are not to die full of all the potential that God has loaded you with. You are supposed to die empty, leaving your footprint at the sand of time. And like the statement I made before, if you are not imparting any life, and if no one is learning something from you, then you are wasting God's time on earth. And now come with a question. How will you be remembered? when you finish on earth and move on to eternity. Look at the conclusion of the study. So in life, you must be a contributor and not a consumer. God is a God of impacts and you will be remembered by the impact that you have made, either positive or negative. In the history of the world, the men and women we are remembering today for good were those who made impacts, who did something in their generation. The Bible says, and David, David served God in his generation, and he slept with his fathers. And David served God in his generation, and then slept with his fathers. The only reason you are reading about David now is because he rendered service. He served, he rendered service. He served others. He made an impact. If you are a selfish person, me, 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 ah, ah, my family, my wife, my children, my wife, ah, 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 you will not make any impact. If you are not willing to do anything free for anybody, you will not make any impact. If you are not ready to sacrifice, you will not make an impact. I fear that some will get to heaven and the Lord will say, welcome, you are here. This is what you are supposed to do on earth. You did not do 5% of what you are supposed to do. And because you did not do your own bit, other people now start having problems. When you do not do your own bit, there will be an aftermath of that your bit you did not do because it will certainly show. Because the way God created man, He has not created us in isolation. He created us who can be linked to one another. That is a reason you are in that family. That is a reason you are in that group. That is a reason you are in that house. That is a reason you are in that company. If you leave the place and make no impact, the ball is in your court. Many years back, in a particular factory, they employed casual laborers every day. Casual laborers every day. This set of casual laborers were employed. But among them, they employed one man. This man was a prayer warrior. During break, while all of them are eating, you find him sitting in one corner. Pray, pray, pray. The one hour break, he does not open his eyes. It is when they ring the bell that break is over that you open the eye and go and continue his work. They start at 9 a.m. in the morning. This brother will arrive around 8 o'clock. Again, while they are sitting outside waiting for them to be called into the company, he starts to really day. doesn't chat with people. Pray, pray. All of a sudden, they were looking for a supervisor. They made him supervisor. But that's why I see cash for laborers. 
Soon he became a foreman. Other were still liberals. They were still casual liberals. Why? He was making an impact in the place. And the impact was serious. Bow down your head. If you're not born again, surrender your life to Jesus now. But you see what I'm going to say after me. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I come before you now. Lord Jesus, come into my life. Take control of my life. In Jesus' name. Amen. These prayers I want you to put. They are prayers that men of God have prayed down the ages. And that has made an impact in their lives. I can see some people tonight who will pray these prayers. And heaven will visit them. So, oh God, Allah, make me one of your champions. Can I hear you shouting it? Let your voice be louder than that. In the name of Jesus, make me one of your champions. But put us at any care. Make me one of your champions in the name of Jesus. You want to become a champion for Jesus? Shout it loud and clear. Make me one of your champions. In Jesus' name we pray. Power to make positive impact. Shout it louder than that. Fall upon my life now in the name of Jesus. Power to make positive impact. Fall upon my life now in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. glory. Something is about to happen to you now that will change your story forever. When you smite that head, you will shout with a loud voice, fire! One! Two! Three! Four! Five! Six! Seven! Now begin to shake that head. Shake it vigorously. Today is the day of deliverance. Shake it vigorously. Something is coming out. Yes, shake it. Every arrow fired into the brain, fired into the head, that they are using to manipulate your glory. Out. 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 In the name of Jesus. Every power that has been manipulating your glory, I bind them and I cast them out in the name of Jesus. Beginning from today, your story must change. 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 In the name of Jesus. 
thank you amplify in jesus name we pray you that person that the enemy has been harassing enough is enough yes i command the power of the oppressor to release your legs use your hands to release your body in the name of jesus Owners of evil law, what are you waiting for? Carry your law in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree it. Command them to carry their loads. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, where is the Lord God of Elijah? Allah, let my story change. In the name of Jesus. Cry unto the Lord now for a change of story. Your story must change, your story must change. Papola Katende Rabo Shente Rabo Santa. The river Sopone Kayabo. Bali Katende Kayabo Shente Rabo Santa. Your story must change. Pray this prayer with violence and with power, without any apology to any power. Anything can happen now. Pray the way you have never prayed before. Surprise! That handed me over to the strong man. You are a liar. In the name of Jesus. Power that handed me over to the strong man. Die in the name of Jesus. Amen. Raise your two hands to the heaven as you pray this prayer. The louder you pray, it, the faster. My blessings held up in the covers. Jesus, come on, to come out. My potter, Satani Kayaboshanda. In Jesus' name we pray. If you are that person, 
that you know that your body is decaying internally. Nobody needs to tell you can smell it. Right there where you are, begin to drink the blood of Jesus. Drink it. Drink it. Drink it. Drink it. Drink it. Drink. 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 Drink the blood of Jesus. Aha. I command you to recover yourself now. In the name of Jesus. With a military voice. Shout this. I shall laugh last. You are not shouting it yet. You are still not shouting it yet. Over my enemies. By the power. In the blood of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree it. Jesus name we pray now from inside your belly not just from the mouth alone if you believe that prayer you just prayed with a loud voice begin to laugh your enemies to scorn <laughs> just laugh them to scorn laugh them to scorn <laughs> Amen. Roar like thunder as I pray now. In this prayer session, anything can happen at any time. Father, in the name of Jesus, your amen is not loud enough. Father, in the name of Jesus, Father, we thank you because your word says that oppression shall be far away from us. Your word says. They that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. Your word says, No weapon formed against us shall prosper. Father, I decree right now that anyone, the weapon of the enemy is already prospering in your life. Receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus. Receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive your deliverance. Receive your deliverance. Receive your deliverance. Receive your deliverance. My supporting higher. Receive your deliverance. In the name of Jesus. When I say one, two, three, go now. You shout the name of Jesus seven aggressive times. And then you keep quiet. One, two, three, go. written anyone that calls on the name of the Lord shall be saved as many as have called upon the name of the Lord just now receive your breakthroughs now in the name of Jesus receive it 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 in the name of Jesus. Silence. Father, I 
all who have been dedicated to one idol or the other. Consciously or unconsciously. Father, these are your angels that are moving around. Let them begin to touch them. Yes. All those who have been dedicated by their parents or anything. Receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus. Say, I receive power to rewrite my family history by the power in the blood of Jesus. Can you shout that loud? Shout it again. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to pray. Jesus name we pray all eyes closed the prayers I want you to pray now they are not ordinary prayers but it's important that you do not negotiate with the enemy it's important that you do not joke with the prayers at all it's important that you pray it well violently immediately the process of this prayer start the miracle hand of God will begin to work. Some people, it will go back 20 years, 30 years, 50 years. Some will just see the body lifting away. Some may actually see the strong man pulling out of their bodies. If you pray these prayers and you lose your voice, but the process of deep deliverance happens in your life, you will have done yourself a world of favor. Why the process of this prayer is going on? There are people all your life they have been pressing you down. It is those power that are pressing you down that you want to unseat now. There are people the enemy has fired all kinds of arrows into your body. It's as if the body does not belong to you. You will see what will happen in the next five minutes. If you will open your mouth and pray aggressively. Blind Bartimaeus screamed and cried out. Jesus son of David have mercy on me his voice was loud enough to embarrass people for the voice of a single man to embarrass a crowd it must be a serious cry it is that kind of cry that can get the breakthrough the bible says in the day that i cry then shall my enemies come back there is somebody here immediately you begin to cry out to god now the enemies that pursue your grandfather pursue your father and is now pursuing you shall be buried alive if in the process of these prayers you find that you could not remain on your feet right there on the floor where you are continue the prayers now place your hand on your belly button area with a voice that nobody beside you will overshadow you will shout this loud and clear blood of jesus In the name of Jesus, Masataya Kaya Boshende Raba. There must be great deliverance. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Aha! 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 Jesus name we pray uh -huh. we're making progress we're making huge progress said voices from my foundation that are attacking my star yeah! in the name of Jesus Oh, 
Yes. Makatenda ya boshente la bosetende ke yaba. Ba pia ni katenda la boshente la bosenta. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. In Jesus, then we pray. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. I am going to count seven from here, which is a sign of perfection. Something is going to happen to three groups of people. Number one set of people. Everywhere you go, you face unexplainable hatred. The power of God will fall upon you and that yoke shall be broken. <laughs> Number two, you are at the edge of a serious breakthrough right now. But some forces have just risen up again to steal that breakthrough. As I count seven, the power of God will fall upon you and that yoke shall be broken. And by the next power must change us, you come here with your testimony. As I count to seven, all those who are here and you came here almost lifeless, the power of God will fall upon you and your blood that has been taken away shall be returned. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, you have been operating for a long time. Today is the expiry date of that operation. Masi katende kaya bo shende raba. Riba sapi ali katende. Just shake the serpent out of your head. Shake the serpent out of your head. Masi katende kaya bo shanda. Aha. Yes. Amen. You that unexplainable swelling in the body, I command you to depart from your hiding place in the name of Jesus. Yes. In the name which is above all names, Jesus Christ. The son of the living God, right there where you are, receive the touch of the great physician in the name of Jesus. Receive the touch of the great physician in the name of Jesus. Aha. There are serious prayers to pray. Very serious prayers. If you pray this prayer, this single prayer we bring you uncommon testimonies pray this prayer to encounter your testimonies joy swallowers of my father's house is that the loudest you can shout it your voice is still not loud enough Make it a louder shout. Yeah! In the name of Jesus. Those who are swallowing the joy of your father's house. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. This is wonderful. This is wonderful. Stretch your right hand towards me here. Father, these hands that are stretched here, let his hand carry the fire power of God. 
Let it carry the healing power of Jehovah. When he uses his hand this day, every bondage shall be broken. And every arrow of death and hell shall go back to the senders. In the name of Jesus. Now, anywhere you're having problem in your body, smite it without mercy 21 times. And shout, go back to your senders. In the name of Jesus. Go back to your senders. In the name of Jesus. Let's go! Satania Aha, aha, aha. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Check your body now. Do what you could not do before. Say this after me. Anything in the land of the dead troubling my life is praise for somebody here because your breakthrough also happened today, 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 today. Anything in the land of the dead troubling my life. Death! In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree it. Masateli Kaya In Jesus' name we pray. That's right. Check that body. Yes. The arrow fired into your head. That makes it look as if it's going to burst. The power of God is coming upon you. That person over there, they say you have cancer fire is coming upon your body and that disease is drying up check your body check your body this particular prayer is a serious one indeed lay your right hand on your head then later you lay your hand on your chest as we pray this prayer let's start with the head foundational injury In my life, can you shout it loud? Is that the loudest you can shout it? Receive healing in the name of Jesus. Yes, foundational injury. Receive healing now. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray say any dark power living in my house or around my house can i hear you saying that loud and clear that voice is not loud enough uh-huh 
get out now in the name of Jesus any dark power living in my house or around my house command them to get out In Jesus name we pray. Silence. Father, I'm praying for anyone under the sound of my voice who has been dedicated to any idol and this idol from the waters from the forest from the mountains the idol that has been controlling this destiny upon everyone like that here let the chain of the idol power be broken now be broken, 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 in the name of Jesus. That evil tree planted in your father's house with your name that has been troubling your life. Let the chain of that satanic tree upon your destiny be broken now in the name of Jesus oh yes aha aha anyone who has stepped on any magic item or any sorcery item or any enchantment item and the thing is affecting their legs let the fire of the god of elijah burn to ashes every plantation of darkness in the name of jesus yes that's the power of god coming upon you father i'm praying for all those here or under the sound of my voice who have been dedicated to the waters and the power controlling their destiny is inside the waters father as i count seven from here let your liquid fire fall upon such people and let the yoke of the waters be broken to pieces one two three four five Six, seven. Aha. You now need to pray this prayer. The prayer that delivered that woman from the bondage. Pass! Assigned to use me as a sacrifice. You are a liar! Die! In the name of Jesus! Deal with that power now! In Jesus' name we pray. A seven for the man. With a loud voice, sing this song of deliverance. Unto thee, O Do I lift up my soul 
loud and clear powers discussing my fears in the covens 
Can you shout that loud? Scatter! In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and decree it. Causing my fears in the covers. Your time is up. My sick heart like I. In Jesus' name, we pray. Anything pronounced against my life. Under satanic anointing. Can I hear the sister saying that one? Brothers. Is that the loudest who can shout it? In the name of Jesus. name we pray I shall laugh last for my enemies in the power the blood of Jesus Mighty name we pray. Sir, Holy Ghost Bulldozer. Open my way in the name of Jesus. Jesus, name we pray. Glory killers of my father's ass. You are a liar. Death in the name of Jesus. Jesus, then we pray. As you pray this next prayer, anytime you are at the edge of a breakthrough, you have some strange dreams and the breakthrough disappears. If you smell strange odors that others don't smell, shout this prayer loud and clear. 
Pass! Come down to disgrace me! Your time is up! Scatter! In the name of Jesus! Something is happening, something is happening. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, rough life. Seat. Can you shout out two things loud and clear? Shout it louder than that. I am not your candidate. Damn! In the name of Jesus. Rough life, back seat. Jesus, then we pray. Point your right hand at me here. Father, let the Holy Ghost fire and the power of deliverance fall upon this hand. In the name of Jesus. As a cancer will now smite your head vigorously. One. I want you to be more aggressive. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven. Masikatenda yaboshende rabo santa. Yes. Makatensetende yaba. Aha. Yes. Bro. Kno. The fretha. He has broken all the fetters. He has broken all the fetters. He has set me free. I will sing hallelujah. I will sing Hallelujah. I will sing Hallelujah. He has set me free. He has set me free. He has broken. He has broken all the fetters. He has broken all my fetters. He has broken all my fetters. He has set me free. He has set me free. I will sing. I will sing. Hallelujah. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Every power that has handed me over to the strong man. Yeah! In the name of Jesus.
every power that has handed me over to the strong man die in the name of Jesus in Jesus name we pray say anything planted in my life to disgrace me can you shout it loud Jesus Let me pray. Prophesy upon your life now. You will shout your name. Say, Daniel, hear the word of the Lord. Arise and shout in the name of Jesus. Arise and shine in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, Daniel, I prophesy upon you. Move forward by fire in the name of Jesus. Prophesy upon yourself. Jesus name we pray now with a voice that roars like thunder you want to give five commands to your hands five hot commands speak to your two hands now with this spiritual order or command God wives I sign against my heart catch fire in the name of Jesus, open your mouth and decree. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Upon my heart, pray in the name of Jesus. It's happening, it's happening, it's happening, it's happening, it's happening. In Jesus' name, we pray. Upon my eyes, pray in the name of Jesus. Enough is enough. Makapote sete ya boshanda. Ruba sape ni katanda. In Jesus name we pray. This is the fourth command. Evil magnets upon my eyes. Catch fire in the name of Jesus.
In Jesus name we pray Stretch your right hand towards me Stretch your right hand towards me Father These hands that are stretched here Let them become instrument of deliverance Instrument of power Instrument of strength Instrument of glory As many infirmity I shall be smitten with this hand Let the infirmity go back to the senders In the name of Jesus You will smite anywhere in your body Where there is trouble You will smite it without mercy And shout go back to your senders In the name of Jesus Go back to your senders In the name of Jesus You need to smite it 21 odd times Let's go Do it right, do it right. Makatenda yabo shante. Thank you, Jesus. Aha, aha. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. The fifth command upon your hand. As you are issued the command, you'll be clapping those hands. Clap it aggressively as you issue the command. My arm receive deliverance in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus silence things are going on a lot of things are going on every spiritual wedding ring of the spirit husband i set you on fire in the name of jesus as the first person that's number two the fingers on fire that's number three number four number five six seven eight nine ten The kind of prosperity you've never experienced before will begin to happen in your life now. Shout this louder than anyone around you. Shout it ten times. I plug myself into the socket of divine favor by the power in the blood Jesus can you say it number one number two Say it now, say it now, say it now. Plug yourself into the socket of divine favor.
Amen. Say every chain upon my hands, upon my legs, break in the name of Jesus. The money chains will be broken. There must be no negotiation. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Powers of pocket with holes. Get out of my head in the name of Jesus. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Cobweb spirits. Get out of my hand. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray it loud. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. These next three prayers, the Lord said, I should tell you, that as many as will open their mouths and pray with violence, within the next ten days, they will have uncommon testimony. These three prayers. My my prosperity in the name of Jesus open your mouth and decree open your mouth open your mouth in Jesus name we pray arrows of failure fired into my heart backfire in the name of Jesus somebody is breaking through oh yes Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus, then we pray. This is the third prayer. Look at what is happening. Look at what is happening. Power of death. A sign against my hand. In the name of Jesus. Oh, yes. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. Rima Pocatessa Tendica. In Jesus' name we pray. Raise the two hands to the evilness now. Raise the devilies. Raise the devilies. I decree that before you will put these hands down, the testimony, the blessings, the virtues that will shock your neighbors and surprise your friends. Receive it now in the name of Jesus. Makate setele yaba. In the name of Jesus, beginning from now, even if you touch what does not sell, it shall become gold and silver in the name of Jesus. I decree that every good thing this house has lost, 
Before you put them down, they must repossess it. Repossess. Repossess it. 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 In the name of Jesus. Say thank you, Jesus. Father, I'm praying for those who are here. And the enemy has swallowed the joy in your marriage. Right there where you are. Whether it is convenient for the enemy or not. Receive your deliverance now in the name of Jesus. Receive it. Aha, aha. That's the power of God. That's the power of God. Pocotara basetende keya boshenta. Manakantandara basopola. Receive it now. In the name of Jesus. Aha. Glory killers. Embargo of my father's house. Can you show this love? Your voice is not loud enough. I think you should try harder than that. Damn! In the name of Jesus. Enough is enough. Bata setela kaya boshendera basanta. Yes. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Jesus name we pray something is about to happen divine acceleration uncommon promotion mysterious elevation it's about to happen now you will shout the name of Jesus Jesus Christ Grace physician I am available touch me now in the name of Jesus Jesus Christ great physician I am available touch me now Touch me now! Touch me now! Touch me now! Touch me now! Thank you, Jesus. 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 Receive the touch of the power. Receive it. the touch of the fire. Receive it. 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 Makapoli kaya bo shendera basanda. In Jesus' name we pray. Somebody is receiving a brand new heart. Somebody is receiving a brand new kidney. Someone is receiving a brand new womb. Check your body now. Check your body. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. You now pray this particular prayer. Arrows of delayed blessing. 
Can you shout it louder than that? Backfire! In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. As someone here this day, I have a word to you from the Lord. The Lord said, I should tell you that your time of uncommon advancement has come. Your time of awesome testimony has come. Listen, the God whom you serve shall cause you to overtake those who have been mocking you. Yes. And your season of accelerated promotion has come in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Let there be silence now. Silence now some surgical operation spiritually is about to take place now all eyes closed you that person over there i divorce you from this spirit that comes to your dream to have constant sex with you i divorce you from them right now in the name of jesus That's the first person. That's number two. That's number three. That's the power of God coming upon them. You can't hide. Enough is enough. I disconnect you over there from the spirit that brings dreams of failure to you. Anytime you are close to a breakthrough, I disconnect you right now in the name of Jesus. I disconnect you that person over there right now from the evil mark placed on your forehead preventing you from moving forward I disconnect you right now in the name of Jesus there is a power of God coming upon you Every evil thing you have trampled upon that is now affecting your walking your legs and they are calling it arthritis and all kinds of names right there where you are I command the arrows that have entered into your leg to go back to the senders in the name of Jesus it's happening makatendere kayabo shendere abosante silence the power of god is about to fall on three persons and those three persons will not be able to stand on their feet these three persons that are powers of eaters of flesh and drinkers of blood right in your bedroom anytime you sleep on that bed and wake up it's as if life is going out of you right there where you are i bind and cast out from your body the spirit of death and hell in the name of Jesus that's the first person that's number two that's number three aha yes you the spirit of cancer hear the word of the lord it is written as soon as they hear of me they shall obey me strangers shall submit themselves unto me 
The strangers shall fade away and they shall be afraid out of their clothes. I bind and cast out every arrow of infirmity of cancer in the name of Jesus. Silence, silence. I'm going to count seven from here. The power of God is going to fall on 50 persons, and they may not be able to stand on their feet. But that will be the end of the blockages they have been noticing. The angels to process that, they are already in the mist. One, two, three, four. Today is your expiry date. You can't block the way of God's people anymore. Thank you, Jesus. All those powers that have been scratching your body when you sleep, I disconnect you from them in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Your time of unprecedented, unexpected, and envious breaking has come in the name of Jesus. Yes. Your God shall make you a showroom of the display of his power in the name of Jesus. Jesus spoke to that deaf person and cried on his head in a language called Ephata. A father is a command. Be open. It is that command that Jesus gave you. You are going to give to now. Can you shout this louder than anyone around you? My way of breakthroughs. My way of joy. A father. In the name of Jesus. in the name of Jesus in Jesus name we pray pray this prayer the way you've never prayed any prayer say me to suffer what my parents suffered can I hear you shouting this last your voice is not loud enough your time is up yeah! in the name of Jesus Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. This is why Jesus brought you here. That's the power of God, that's the power of God, that's the power of God, that's the power of God. Oi! 
yes something is happening that's right the party kit haribo sopanda in jesus then we pray aha uh -huh. your hand on your belly button and shout this loud and clear collective captivity inherited from my parents Damn! in the name of Jesus oh put your mouth oh put your mouth Makapat da riba sopanda kaya da riba sopanda kaya bo shentera basanda in Jesus name we pray aha yes oh yes oh yes see what is happening there's a disconnection going on all over the place the evil blood that flowed into you is being extracted now. Aha. Be released. Be released. Be released. Enough is enough. Shout this with holy anger. Keep your hand on your belly button. Generational deficiency. In the name of Jesus. There's a power of God, there's a power of God, there's a power of God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Remember, your head is a symbol of your destiny. Makapota lika ya bushanda. Ribopo lika disentendeka. Pray this prayer. Don't say you have prayed it before. Owners of evil Lord. Carry your Lord. In the name of Jesus. Oh yes. Carry your loot. Carry your loot. Carry your loot. In Jesus name we pray. Let your voice roar like fire and like thunder. Inherited infirmity. Can you shout this loud? Yeah! In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Something is happening to somebody over there. That's right. Makatenaya Boshenta. Deal with the inherited infirmity. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, I fire back every arrow of disgrace. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and fire it back.
Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, then we pray. Lay your right hand upon your head now and decree this loud and clear. Satanic luggage of my father's house. Shout it with boiling anger. I am not your candidate. Jesus oh yes Jesus Jesus in Jesus name we pray silence now please don't say anything until I ask you to talk now Masekatenda le kaya boshande ribo setila le katende kaya boshande rabo kampia manaka di setende kaya Father, I'm praying for all who are in this gathering and they have been unconsciously dedicated to a shrine, to an idol, to an evil power. Wherever such people are, the covenant, conscious, unconscious, between them and the idol, between them and the shrines between them and the evil agreement between them and the evil agreement i break it in the name of jesus be broken 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 in the name of jesus It's happening. It's happening. Yes. The dedication to the waters. The dedication to the forest. The dedication to any occultic power. Break in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. That person who cannot use the legs very well, Jesus is by your side. Therefore, arise and use those legs in the name of Jesus. Put your foot into action and use those legs right now. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Father, I'm praying for all those who used to dream of going back to their former house, going back to their former schools, going back to their old apprentice workshop, going back to places they have surpassed, taking examination they have passed before. Mapota Setia, wherever such people are now, any covenant between you and backwardness, I break it now in the name of Jesus. You broke it. 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 In the name of Jesus. Yes. Shout it. 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 Shout it.
shout this loud and clear power of the grave of my father's heart Death! in the name of Jesus Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Now, if somebody, you are so close to breakthrough that will change your story. So, say that amen with violence. Every power that does not want you to rejoice, I bury them now in the name of Jesus. Possessor possession, possessor possession, possessor possession, possessor possession, possessor possession, possessor possession in the name of Jesus. Stretch your right hand towards this altar now. Father, we thank you for all powers belong to you. You are our rock, you are our strength. Your word says, with man, this is impossible. But with God, all things are possible. Father, by your power, which has no respect for impossibility, lay your hands upon the hands of your people in the name of Jesus. Lay your hands upon the hands of your people in the name of Jesus. As you lay your hands on your body now, in a prophetic action, the hand of God will arise and fight all your battles. In the name of Jesus. Lay that hand on your belly button. Lay it there. And let there be silence. Father, where there is the spirit of untimely death, right there where you are, receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, silence. They are departing. Yes, the spirit of death and hell is coming out through the mouth, through the nose, through the womb. That's the power of God coming upon you, Father. As many as are here, and they are wallowing under the bondage of inherited poverty inherited backwardness inherited failure receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus thank you Jesus every snake in your foundation that is biting your future I kill that serpent now in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus silence now very gently now gently not aggressively gently I'm going to count seven from here. Smite your boiling betting area seven times. Gently. One. Something is coming out already. Two. Three. The spirit of your mother is releasing you now. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Now with a voice that roars like thunder, can you shout this louder than anyone around you? Arrows fired from my foundation into my destiny. 
Caio está de lá. Your voice is not loud enough. Dead. In the name of Jesus. My partner said, "Yeah, he can't ever." Jesus, name we pray. You are going to pray. The prayer is in the song, and you sing the song ten times. Ten times. Don't let anybody's voice be louder than yours. The song is a prophetic proclamation. It's a powerful prayer. Don't let anybody's voice overshadow your voice. Ten times. Ten good times. All eyes closed. Are you ready? Thank you, Jesus. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus, turn me to fire, turn me to fire, turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus, turn me to fire, turn me to fire, turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus, turn me to fire, turn me to fire, louder, louder, louder. In the name of Jesus, turn me to fire, turn me to fire, turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus, turn me to fire, turn me to fire. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire, turn me to fire, turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire, turn me to fire. Louder, louder, louder. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire, turn me to fire, turn me to fire, oh Lord. Say anointing that terrifies the enemy. Come upon my life now. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to ask for that anointing, anointing that terrifies the enemy. Come upon my life now. In the name of Jesus, thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. Father, I'm praying right now for all who have breakthrough still hanging in this year. I decree by the decree of heaven that every breakthrough that has been dedicated to this year for you, in a mysterious, strange way, possess your possession in the name of Jesus. I decree upon your life that none of your blessings shall disappear with this year. In the name of Jesus. Any power that is traveling anywhere to harm you, any power that is going into the spirit realm to harm you, will never come back. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Now with a loud voice, pray this yoke-breaking prayer. Pray it without apology. Say, yoke breaker! Jesus Christ! Break my yokes now! In the name of Jesus!
in Jesus name we pray some people are being followed around by some evil powers the agenda of this power is to scuttle everything they are doing any good thing they are doing they scuttle them follow follow powers powers following me for evil turn back in the name of Jesus Deal with that power now. But support Ali Katendekia. Ribo Sapondekia Boshente Rabasante. Powers following me for evil. Turn back. Turn. In Jesus' name we pray. Stretch forward your two hands like someone who wants to receive a big present and let your amen be dynamic as I pray those gifts back into your hands father it is written that we will possess our possession anything good that has been stolen from any life no matter how long it has been stolen as this house has stretched forth now everything that has been stolen from you beginning from your mother's womb reprocess them now in the name of Jesus reprocess them 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 in the name of Jesus That says you will not possess your marriage any power that says you will not have your own children any power that says you will not possess your wealth I command them to die in the name of Jesus possess your possession now possess your possession possess your possession possess your possession possess your possession in the name of Jesus in Jesus name we pray then you pray this prayer Daniel Olukoye hear the word of the Lord can you shout that loud allies and shout in the name Jesus open your mouth and decree that prayer thank you Jesus Daniel Olukoye, hear the word of the Lord. Arise and shout. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, anointing that breaks the yoke. Come upon my life now. In the name of Jesus. Let your voice be loud.
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. This third prayer, you now apply a prophetic action. As you are praying it, wait for me to tell you the prayers. As you are praying it, begin to clap your hand loudly. That clap shall ordain terrifying noises against your enemies. You shout this loud and clear. Evil family pattern! Break! In the name of Jesus, command the evil family pattern to break! 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 Break in the name of Jesus! 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 My partner said, Louder, 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 louder! Break, break in the name of Jesus! Jesus name we pray the Lord blesses you from that make his face to shine upon you cover your family with the blood of Jesus the eyes that never slumbers nor see shall be upon you the sun shall not smite you by day nor the moon by night thank you heavenly father in Jesus mighty name we pray In your voice with the voice of enough is enough declare these three prayers before you sit down say mountains posting against me scatter in the name of jesus scatter the posting mountains in the name of jesus thank you jesus In Jesus' name we pray. This next prayer will make somebody here to receive a special attention from heaven. My days of affliction expire in the name of Jesus. Command the days of affliction to expire. That's right. In Jesus' name we pray. Any house in my place of birth cooking my destiny. Can I hear you shouting this like thunder? Jesus, open your mouth and begin to pray. Aha! Today is today. This is not a day to negotiate. Basapunde ke ya bo shentera bo konta. The real pale katana. Yes, yes. Today is today. Yes, don't negotiate. In Jesus name we pray something is happening here something has happened in so many places that's right that's right we used to sing a song here we say he made impossibility possible he made impossibility Jehovah Jireh Jehovah Nisi Jehovah Rohi it is impossibility. Now with fire in your voice. Say, go lion! Speaking impossibility into my life. Dead! In the name of Jesus. Oh. 
Open your mouth, open your mouth. Don't be afraid. Masekaya Open your mouth, open your mouth. In Jesus, then we pray. Yes. That person here, you lost a very good opportunity. But the Lord said, as a result of your prayer here today, a new one and a better one will come your way. That's right. I say, man over there, God said he will have exalted you to a high position. But you refuse to correct your marriage. Please go and do marriage correction. So that God can install you into this high position. That sister over there. You did not know. But you were unconsciously installed in the demonic world as a queen. Right there where you are. That crown of darkness upon your head. And the ring of the spirit husband upon your fingers. They are catching fire now. In the name of Jesus. It's happening. I have a message for three persons. The Lord said before this week runs out. It will rearrange you into dumbfounded financial blessings. Thank you Jesus. That man turned upside down by two dead women. You have been released now. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Another person over there. The destruction of your destiny, energized by polygamous witchcraft, is being reversed right now. Amen. With violence and with fire. Occultic agent. Amen. Chanting my name for evil. Somebody needs to pray this one. Seriously. Can I hear everybody shouting this loud? I can't. Scatter! In the name of Jesus. They must scatter! Aha, aha, aha. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Aha, 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 aha. In Jesus' name we pray. Silence. The chain binding the womb. The chain binding the breast. The chain. Finding the head. Break. By the power. In the blood of Jesus. And I'll be silent. Things are still happening here. Plenty of things. And we're just warming up in this prayer. Because we're, we're still moving towards a place. Somebody said you never knew both parents. They were killed by the wicked. Those powers that killed them. They are, they've been trying to pursue you too. But I have an information for you. That they are all dead. That's right. That's right. 
That's right. That's right. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The God of new beginnings is working on so many lives now. That's right. Uh You, that person over there, at your own dead father has been harassing you in your dream. Be set free now in the name of Jesus. And that person headed for the embassy this week. The strong man that has been binding your legs has been shaken out of your way. Many things are happening here. Now we're ready. The angel to carry this assignment out has just arrived. Now with a voice roaring like thunder, you will now shout this loud and clear. Evil trees in my land. Hear the word of the Lord. Dry up. Die. Dry up. Die. Evil tree in my land. Hear the word of the Lord. Dry up. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to pray now. Yes. Oh, yes. Thank you, Jesus. 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 name we pray this is wonderful this is wonderful this is wonderful Aha. now I want you to be specific whatever you want to kill in your own life whatever Goliath has been harassing your life maybe it's backwardness pregnancy spiritual powerlessness it's time to speak death into that Goliath now you will now say this loud and clear. Goliath of whatever you want to put inside. I curse you to die. Your own may be marital problem, maybe financial trouble, maybe poverty, maybe stagnancy, maybe failure. Goliath of failure. I curse you to die. In the name of Jesus, pray specific prayer now. Basepe la karabo koshente rabakarabo sanda. Thou power of God, in the name of Jesus, move.
Aha! Something is happening here. Jesus name we pray. Wow. Glory be to the name of the Lord. Right there where you are, with the loudest voice you can gather, can you just pick any song of praises and sing it loud and clear to the King of Kings and to the Lord of Lords? Any song of praises? Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Let there be glory and honor and praise. Is a glory and honor to Jesus. Let there be glory, let there be honor, glory and honor to let there be glory. Sing it loud and clear, glory and honor to Jesus. Let there be glory, let there be honor. Sing it loud and clear. See everything turn around for my faith. Oh, I can see everything turning around. Turning around, turning around for my faith. Oh, I can see everything. See everything. See everything turning around for my faith. Oh, I can see everything turning around. 
turning around and around for my oh, oh, I can see everything. Oh, oh see everything. Oh, see everything turning around for my face. Oh, I can see everything. Oh, see everything. See everything turning around. One more time, one more time. I, I can see everything turning around. Turning around. Turning around. Turning around for my face. Shout hallelujah! Seven prayers before you go. And you have just one or two minutes to pray them. But pray this one with fire and with power. Speak into the womb of this month. Speak into the womb of this year. Pray the way the psalmist told us. He said, open wide your mouth. And just pray big prayers, giant prayers, unbelievable prayers. Say this loud and clear. Goliath power! Press it down my head. In the name of Jesus. I refuse to be pressed down. Masataka Riboko Likatanda Sandayaba. In Jesus' name we pray. Uh huh. That's good. The Bible says, I rise and shine. Say, Goliath power. Slowing down my progress. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, open your mouth, don't be afraid. Jesus, then we pray. There are three sisters here. The Lord said there are Goliaths in your place of birth that have collected your dowry in the spirit realm. Before next Sunday, they shall be dead. Aha. Thank you, Jesus. Say this loud and clear. Goliath power mocking my prayers in the name of Jesus. That's right. Masakaya Boshendera Bokonta. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, so where is the Lord God of Elijah? Allah! Is that the loudest who can shout it? Make me great! In the name of Jesus. Masekaya bo shende raba kanta rabo sanda. In Jesus name we pray. Goliath in my dreams. Your time is up. Yeah! In the name of Jesus. That's right. In Jesus, then we pray. Oh God, I remember me for good. In the name of Jesus, let him open the book of remembrance. Jesus then we pray the last one Elijah asks Elisha what do you want me to do for you said my father let me receive a double portion of your power ah see, thou ask us for a hard thing the man who called down fire who raised the dead is now saying somebody has asked for a hard thing say, but however you can see me 
when I'm being taken away from you, it shall be so. So what? If you don't see me, it shall not be so. <laughs> God is still in the business of doing hard things. This is the final prayer I wanted to pray here today and go with that anointing into this week. Where is the Lord God of Elijah? For me in the name of Jesus Infirmities in my blood. Can you shout this loud? Death in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray it. Bakatela kaya bo shendera bo sepela kanta. Put your mouth up, put your mouth. In Jesus' name we pray. Silence. Don't say anything. Now, you strangers. It is written. But as soon as they hear of me, they shall obey me. Strangers shall submit themselves unto me. The strangers shall fade away and they shall be afraid out of their closeness. Every stranger inside the body, the stranger inside the blood, the stranger that wants to embarrass and disgrace you. Hear the word of the Lord. That place you are, it's not your habitation. Get up now. As the first person, he's going. Get out now. That's number two. Get out now. That's number three. Any sickness unto death inside the body, I bind you. I cast you out. 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 I bind you. I cast out of that body in the name of Jesus. And you shout this loud and clear. I fire back every arrow of witchcraft by the power in the blood of Jesus. Open your mouth and fire it back. Thank you, Jesus. This prayer is for 27 persons this week. Even if you don't feel concerned, pray the prayer. Fire of favor that cannot be quenched. Possess me now in the name of Jesus. Yes, it's up 
happening, it's happening, it's happening. In Jesus' name we pray. With a voice louder than anyone around you. If you can still ask, you have somebody pray. You have, you have not started prayer. This is 70 days pastor's prayer meeting. My glory. Hear the word of the Lord. Get out of the room of battle. Can you say it? Which room did you have commanded to get out from? Room of battle. My glory! Hear the word of the Lord. Get out of the room of battle in the name of Jesus. Be released, 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 be released. Aha, aha! Does the power go coming upon you? In Jesus' name we pray. Power, sir! Holding wicked meetings against me. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, no matter my background. Receive, receive the anointing to be great. Receive the anointing. Receive it. 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 In the name of Jesus. Aha. Aha. Then we pray the next series of prayers. They are not gentlemen's prayer. As we pray this first prayer, if you are here and somebody physically approached you and told you to your face that I will destroy you. Find a way to this altar and be on your knees. Pray the way you've never prayed before so that their arrows can go back to their senders. This is a very, very serious matter. Pass! That hates my existence. Can you shout it loud? Jesus. Don't negotiate. This is not a money to negotiate.
Bakate la kaya bo shendera bo sente. Ribo sopole kaya bo koshatia. Thank you, Jesus. 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 to shout my own. Strong man! Stubborn pursuer! Your time is up! Down! In the name of Jesus! Shout it, shout it. Don't negotiate. Strong man. Stubborn pursuers. Your time is up. Damn. Yes, yes, yes. In Jesus' name we pray. You that infirmity in the breast, you the infirmity in the backbone, you the infirmity in the womb, you the infirmity in the eyes. Hear the word of the Lord. It is written by the stripes of the Lord Jesus Christ. The people of God are healed. You are a stranger where you are. Loose your hold in the name of Jesus. Loose your hold. 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 There are 71 women here. These 71 women. The amen you are going to say to this prayer now will bring you unending laughter. Father, I'm praying for this woman. Makita Likayabu Shinderaba. Everywhere they are 
tie down your children. Repossess them in the name of Jesus. You possess them. 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 In the name of Jesus. It's happening. It's happening. Jesus. Amen. I am going to pray now. After the prayer, I'm going to ask you to pray. Because already the cloud of God's power is hanging all over this place. For those who will pull it down upon their own heads. Father, as many as are here today. You said when the day of Pentecost was fully come, clothing tongues as of fire came upon those who are gathered. Father, gather those tongues of fire upon this place now. And as many as will call upon you here, let your power, your glory, your mightiness, your anointing overshadow them in the name of Jesus. With the power of God upon you, receive power to draw the power upon your life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Now with a voice that roars like thunder. As, as many as love their destiny. Can you shout this loud and clear? Holy Ghost power. I am available. Overshadow my life. In the name of Jesus. Continue, continue. Open that mouth, open that mouth. Don't be afraid. Receive it, 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 receive it. Bapoka telikaya boshendera basanda. Louder, 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 louder. See what is happening. See what is happening. Yes, sir. Basikatela kaya boshanda. Fire, 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 fire. Jesus. Jesus. Amen. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes. Yes. Those of you who have received the baptism of the Holy Ghost with a loud voice begin to pray in tongues. Those of you who have not received them begin to ask for the fire the fire 
the fire, the fire, the fire, the fire, the fire, the fire, the fire. Makate sete la kaya boshenda. Ribo sepe ni katenda kaya boko shete rabosoto. Deri de ketende la bakaya boko shente rabosanda. Malika tende rabosopo la kaya boko shete. Ribo sopo nde keye boshete raboko seta. Makatenda ribo kosopo la kaya ba. Bokaya boko shempo la kaya boshente raba. Ribo sopo la kaya boshanta. Jesus. Amen. Yes. 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 Power to terrify all your enemies. Yes. Receive it. Father, we thank you. As you pray this prayer, if your destiny is somewhere else, but the devil has tied you down in another place, the evil rope tie you down shall be broken to pieces. Don't joke with this prayer. Can you shout this loud and clear? Oh, hand of God! my story and restore my glory. Oh, hand of God. Arise. Rewrite my story. Restore my glory. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Any power that says I will not live and prosper. Can you shout it with only anger? What are you waiting for? Damn! In the name of Jesus. Oh, yes. Makapota setende keyabo shende raba kopea. Dariba sopende keyabo. In Jesus' name we pray. Any spiritual gun targeted at my glory. Can I hear you saying that again? Back in the name of Jesus. Yes. See what is happening now. In Jesus' name we pray. Surprise! Abara. Shocking goodness from my body. Is that the loudest you can shout? In the name of Jesus. Name we pray. Lord, we Jesus, Lord, we so any power that 
that says, I will not rise while they are still alive. Can you shout this with only anger? Your voice is not loud enough. Kill yourself in the name of Jesus. Jesus. Makatenda ya boshendera boko pola ba. Open your mouth and decree. In Jesus' name we pray. The powers working against answers to my prayers. Can I hear the sisters shouting this one? Sisters, I want you to be more aggressive. Brothers, let me hear you roaring like thunder. In the name of Jesus. Jesus name we pray oh God Allah give me a miracle that will make me forget my past sufferings oh God Allah Give me a miracle that will make me forget my past sufferings in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. In Jesus' name we pray. Say long term battles. In my life. Come out. And die. Can I hear you shouting this? Your voice is not loud enough. Your voice is still not loud enough. In the name of Jesus. Bakapo sete la kaya bo shendera bo koponda kantera ba. Da kaya bo shendera bo setia. Yes. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. In Jesus' name we pray. Occultic arrows. Fired against me. Back fire. In the name of Jesus. Something is happening here tonight. This is not a night to negotiate. Bakapota la kaya bo shendera bo santa. Aha, 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 aha. In Jesus' name we pray. Garment of shame and disgrace. In the name of Jesus, just then.
Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Don't be tired. Bakapola kaya bo shendera ba. In Jesus' name we pray. Lordu ko Jesus la ba adu. Pass. Eyangala. Assigned to use my glory to collect promotion. In the kingdom of darkness. Can I hear you shouting out? Make your voice louder than that. Make it louder than that. In the name of Jesus. Jesus name we pray any good thing in my life that the enemy has buried come alive in the name of Jesus yes open that mouth open that mouth something is happening right there where you are Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Everybody should pray this prayer with aggression. If you, if you are not married, store the prayer in your prayer bank. Batus! Batus! Assign against me and my children. Can you shout it loud? Can you shout it loud? Shout it with holy anger. What are you waiting for? In the name of Jesus. Oh yes. Jesus. Don't negotiate. This is not a night to negotiate here. But Paul can take the In Jesus name we pray. Powers. Assigned to split my life into two. Can you shout it loud? Catch fire in the name of Jesus. Yes. Open your mouth, 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 open your mouth. Jesus' name we pray. Any cage that has refused to let me go. Can I hear you saying that again? Catch fire in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. So many things are happening here. Open your mouth and decree. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Powers are assigned to break my ladder of greatness. Can you say it again? Fall down and die in the name of Jesus. 
Jesus. Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Where is the Lord God of Elijah? Go to the source of my battles. And kill it. Can I hear the sister shouting this? Sisters, I want you to put your emphasis on and kill it. Sisters, can I hear you shouting again? Where? Shout it louder, sisters. Aha, aha. Let the brothers roar like thunder. Everybody together. In the name of Jesus. Aha, go to the source and kill it. Jesus, then we pray. Lord, with a voice louder than anyone around you. Say wherever if it is, the enemies of my soul shall run to. Can you say that? And we be a king God. Can you say it again? Say it again. Let us see. Father. Baba, locate them and bring them down in the name of Jesus. Whatever they shall run to, Jesus. 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 Jesus then we pray then 10 aggressive times with each one becoming louder I shall see my Egyptians no more by the power in the blood of Jesus shout it 10 times number 2 Number three. Number four. Number five. Number six. Number seven. Louder, louder. Number eight. Number nine. Number 10. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. As many people as love their destiny, there are angels of the living God around to see that this next prayer happens instantly in your life. Oh God, arise! Give me prophetic dreams. Oh God, arise! Give me prophetic eyes. 
For me, there are two only. Can I hear the sister shouting those who did? Yes, you are the one who did. Brothers, can I hear you shouting the same thing? Yes, you are the one who did. Aha. Aha. Everybody together now. Open your mouth and decree in the name of Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, who called Jesus? That God do that. I have three strange words for somebody who has prayed this prayer. Only our Emma JG. The Lord said, I should tell you that every dream that translates to death, setback, if I say poverty, is failure that you have been having shall not come to pass in your life. In the name of it shall not come to pass in your life. Listen, God's judgment of sudden destruction will fall upon the powers that do not want you to celebrate. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Your strong opposition shall be permanently silenced in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Voices calling for my fall. Die by thunder and fire. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, then we pray. Lord, who called Jesus, like Badura, pray this with aggression and fire. By lake, by lake, pa, at you know, curses issued against the labor of my hands. A good one, my share, and no decision, one expert in the name of Jesus. Lord, who called Jesus. Any constitution against the labor of my hands expire in the name of Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, then we pray. Lord, who called Jesus, like Badura. Curses on my father's hands. A good to a low baba me. Curses on my mother's hands. A good to a low yami. Seeking for my hand. To one wow water me. Can I hear you shouting that loud? I keep it alone, Rana. Jesus. 
Bakatenda raboko sotonde ke ya boshenda Ribos ponde ke tela ka ya boko shente rabakapola bakatenda rabasanda Yes Belly in Jesus name we pray Lord ko Jesus lagbadura Owners of deep problems Carry your Lord in the name of Jesus. Oh, put your mouth, put your mouth, put your mouth. Puya mata puya mata puya ma basepeti la kaya boshende raba. In Jesus name we pray. Lord God Jesus la guadura. Angels of deliverance. Yes, yes, yes. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. name we pray say strange enemies strange battles strange problems can you shout those three things is that the loudest you can shout that Jesus. Jesus. Bakapota le kaya boshende rabasanda. Dali ketende rebo soponde kaya boshende. Today is a day of deliverance. Aha, 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 aha. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, who called Jesus? Lagwadura. Powers! Adora! That has swallowed my future. Don't you be a girl, Mimi? Vomit them by fire! In the name of Jesus. Commandant of Vomit Dad. Jesus name we pray. Lord who called Jesus like Badura. Drug man. Oh, Korea like Badura. Stealing my destiny. Don't you hear your mommy? Can you shout this loud? He got a low rider. Death. In the name of Jesus. Lord who called Jesus. Put that mouth, put that 
Thank you, Jesus. Enough is enough. Bakapote setende ke ya boshende la bata. Balike tenderio. Lokotende ke tende ke ya boshende la ba. Opuna mato, opuna mato, opuna mato. Open them out, open them out, open them out. Bakate setia. Danika tendera bo shendera bo kopola bakatandara bo santa. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, we call Jesus. Like Badura. Any infirmity, I lera kai lera, assigned to silence my destiny. Ti wana pe ko pa yon mo mi le nu mo. Can you shout it with eight red? Eki bela ko lu kori ra. Make your voice louder than that. Go so ke juba yelo. Make it even louder than that. Go so ke gidi gidi. In the name of Jesus. My destiny shall not be silenced. Jesus name we pray. Lord who called Jesus. Pass! Adoro! Assigned to trade my destiny for rituals. This is a serious prayer, beloved. I want you to pray without any apology. Pass! Adoro! Assigned to trade my destiny. Tiwana for rituals. Back up on your mom, Michelle Tutu. What are you waiting for? Heal and do it. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Masati la katende yaba. Somebody is breaking through right. Bapoli katende ke ya boshende raba. Yes. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, who called Jesus? La Guadula. Powers. Agara. Assigned to torment me with charms. Do you want to be confused? Good damn it, Lord! Can you shout it? Keep it up, King Bob. Die with your charms. Who do you want to go? In the name of Jesus. Lord, we call Jesus. 
Open your mouth and say it. I know that go with me. Yes. Belly. Yes. Belly. Ma pa. Ya kate. Ni karibo sopande ke ya mo shende raba. Yes. Belly. Name we pray. Lord, who called Jesus Labadura? Pass! Abela! Consulting the grave against me. Don't pay Zakula when Lord is in. What are you waiting for? You don't do not 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 do Open that mouth, open that mouth. Back at the city. Yes! Benny. Don't negotiate. I do not do that. Everybody say this loud. Any animal. Crying in the midnight. To terminate my life. Cry to death. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray against them. Open your mouth and pray. But set in the care of us and their abosoto. We pray, Lord, who called Jesus, Labadura, any mouth, any canoe, licking charm or magic, don't talk to cast my star. That if you are woman, sisters, and you will be can I hear you shouting this? I keep it at King God. Let me hear the students are shouting that prayer. Oh, my name will keep you like a Let me hear the brothers roaring like a dog. Yes. Catch fire! Catch fire! Catch fire! In the name of Jesus. Lord, who called Jesus? Set the mouth ablaze. Can you see it or not? Aha! 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 Jesus! 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 Run mad and die! 
in the name of Jesus. Jesus. Yes. See, see what's going on. Open that mouth. Open that mouth. Open that mouth. Just baby. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord God, Jesus. Pass! Pain, Pain which doctor to steal my glory. Can you say it again? Ramadan day. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, God, Jesus. This next prayer is three one. Make him where you're coming. Powers. I got a assign to attack me with problems that have no solution. Can you say it with anger? Say it with a loud voice. What are you waiting for? Death! In the name of Jesus. Jesus, 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 in Jesus' name we pray. Lord, who called Jesus, any demonic power hiding in any organ of my body. Can you shout this loud? Shout it with a loud voice. Damn! In the name of Jesus. 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 Deal with it. Deal with it. Deal with it. In Jesus' name we pray. Oh God, Allah. Command my glory to speak. In the land of the living, can I hear the sisters shouting this? The sisters, you are not loud enough. Uh, brothers, can you raise it by fire? In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to command your glory to speak. In the land of the living. Somebody is already breaking through with this press. In 
Jesus name we pray this of you at the altar stretch your right hand towards me if you are watching us anywhere too and this case concerns you get on your knees and do what exactly what do I do father let your power fall upon these hands you said we shall lay our hands on the sick and they shall recover let the power of recovery fall upon these hands in the name of Jesus I'm going to count seven from here. Smite your womb area aggressively. Seven times. Even if it's painful, don't worry. Smite it. Something is about to happen. One. Two. You cannot hide. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. You cannot hide. Enough is enough. Loose your hood. 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 Every plantation by the stubborn spirit husband. Loose your hold, loose your hold, loose your hold, loose your hold in the name of Jesus. Everybody will shout this louder than anyone around them. Don't say, I think I've prayed this before. Arrows from the cradle. What are you doing in my life? Can you shout that loud? Your voice is not aggressive enough. Come out now! In the name of Jesus. Continue, continue. Jesus, then we pray. Get yourself ready again. Those of you at the altar. Now you are going to smite ten times. Something is coming out. Something is being dissolved. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Check your body now. Check your body now. Check your body now. Yes, that which has been planted there by the enemy has vanished. Check it now. Yes, check it very well. Yes. Makatenda leka yabo shende. Ribosepe leke yabo shende. Nakandera bosanda yabo sa. Yes. Yes. If you find a swelling that has disappeared in your body, talk to the ministers here and the ushers about it. Don't let the devil put it back. Everybody will shout this loud and clear. Documents of my parents' errors. In the coven of darkness. Documents of my parents' errors. In the coven of darkness. That is putting my progress on hold. Can I hear you shouting this? Shout. 
Shout it loud. Catch fire. In the name of Jesus. Something is up over there. Yes, yes. Command it to catch fire. In Jesus' name we pray. So every tongue gather to destroy me. Destroy yourself. In the name of Jesus. This is not a night to negotiate. Yes. Yes. Yes, yes. Jesus then we pray just check that womb once the fiber has disappeared and the pain has disappeared find a way quickly to the altar here don't let the devil put it back thank you Jesus as we pray this next prayer if you are here in this meeting you have had partial stroke before. The enemy has been trying to attack you with paralysis. Find a way to the altar here. As you pray this next one. If you have a testimony, just share it with the pastor over there. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Can you shout this loud? Those of you at the altar, pray it with fire and with power. I shall not see shame. Shame manufacturers. Carry your shame in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, open your mouth and decree it. Receive the touch of the power. Receive the touch of the fire. Receive the touch of the power. Thou power of God, in the name of Jesus, move, 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 move. In Jesus' name we pray. This prayer will cause great deliverance for thousands of people here tonight. Can you shout this loud and clear? Tongues of wicked elders are signed against me. Can you shout it loud? Dry up! 
in the name of Jesus. Dry up their tongue. This is not a day to negotiate. name we pray. If you are here in this meeting, you are in a place of work. The place you as contract staff, you have worked for years, they refuse to permanent your appointment, but you want to be a permanent staff, find a way quickly to this altar. And the next two prayers, pray it with fire and with power. You have been working hard there, but they've kept you on contract staff. But you want a permanent thing. Find a way to this altar now. Pray the way you have never prayed before. Everybody in this gathering tonight, let your voice be the loudest as we shout this. Oh God, arise! Give me a new name that will rubbish my enemies. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. Give me a new name that will rubbish my enemies. In Jesus' name we pray. Now everybody in this garden shout this one 21 times. When you get to number 10, the power from heaven hanging around here will fall on so many people. Make sure your the voice is the loudest here. Say, I receive power from on high in the name of Jesus. Can you repeat that? Let me hear you. Amen. Now, 21 hot times. When you get to number 10, something will happen. Are you ready? Open your mouth and pray. Number two. Number three. Number four. Number five. Number six. Makapota Satella. Number six. Number seven. Number eight. Number nine. Number ten. Makatesa tela kaya bosha. Aha.
Receive it, 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 receive it. That's a power, that's a power, that's a power, that's a power. See what is happening. Yes. Get yourself ready again. Lay your hand on your tummy, your stomach, on the top of your belly button, on the top of your belly button. Shout this loud and clear. Ancestral powers that want me to die in battles. Can you shout it with only anger? Your time is up. Day. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Jesus name we pray as we pray this next prayer if you are in this meeting you are praying to have a scholarship to study and you believe in the God of signs and wonders find a way to this altar now and be on your knees Pray the two prayers here the way you have never prayed before. Can you shout this loud? Anointing to erase insult. Come upon my Lord in the name of Jesus. to erase insults. Come upon my life now. In Jesus' name we pray. You that lady over there. I have a prayer for you here. Makatesa Lekaya Boshanda. Those powers preparing the wrong man or woman for you to marry. Yes. Release her now. Those powers preparing the wrong woman for this man to marry. Release him now. Those powers saying that you will not marry at all. I bury them now. 
I bury them now. I bury them now. I bury them now. I bury them now. I bury them now. In the name of Jesus. Those powers saying your children will not marry. I bury them now in the name of Jesus. I will fold their mind to that. With hunger in your soul. Pray this loud and clear. Some people did this against Paul in the Bible. They failed. They will fail in your case too. Power, sir. Praying and fasting to see my end. Can you shout with it only anger? Your time is up. Dead. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus, then we pray. Arrows from satanic birds. Backfire in the name of Jesus. Arrows from satanic birds. Command them to backfire now. In the name of Jesus. Jesus name we pray every altar in my place of birth can you shout it loud steal him from me catch for in the name of Jesus Jesus name we pray three more prayers before you sit down you are here in this meeting today is actually your first day here just by stepping there today the Lord who sees your heart has destroyed those stubborn battles if you are that person, today is your first day here. You have been facing battles. Find a way to this altar and be on your knees too. If you have won the battle just by stepping out. But find a way to this altar and be on your knees and pray seriously. Pray seriously. Today is your first day here. But you've been facing battles. Find a way to this place. I'm get on your knees and pray seriously. Say every dragon. 
can you shout it loud? Hanging around my glory. Can you shout it loud? Jesus, then we pray. Two more prayers while laying your hand on your head. You will shout this loud and clear. My head! My head! My head! Can you shout that loud? Hear the word of the Lord. Arise and shout. In the name of Jesus. Jesus name we pray one more now before you sit down but if you are here in this meeting you dreamt a personality came to you and told you point blank point blank that you will never marry find a way to the altar also if you are here and presently there is a satanic conspiracy against you in your place of work find a way to this altar too and be on your knees this is not a time to negotiate can you shout this loud and clear everybody even if you don't understand the prayer pray it with anger Every God's slow spirit affecting my destiny. In the name of Jesus. The God's slow spirit. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Now the power of God is coming upon you.
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Add this one before you sit down. There is a woman who needs to pray this prayer very well. And a breakthrough will start today. Everybody shout this loud and clear. Blessings that the enemy has killed. Hear the word of the Lord. Wake up! In the name of Jesus. Name we pray. As I will fall the mat. Father, we thank you for tonight. For this first manna water service. As many as are gathered here, I decree upon your life. And I prophesy upon you that every agenda of darkness for your life this year is scattered in the name of Jesus. Whether the enemy likes it or not, whether it is convenient for the enemy or not, you are not permitted to fail in the name of Jesus. Whether it is convenient for the enemy or not. Whether they like it or not. Your head. Your head. Your head. Must be lifted up in the name of Jesus. Must be lifted up. Must be lifted up. Must be lifted up. Must be lifted up. Let your amen roar like thunder. They must be lifted up. Must be lifted up. Must be lifted up. Must be lifted up. In the name of Jesus. And you that person over there, the strange voice that has been telling you that nothing can be done about your situation. I bury that voice in the name of Jesus. And every battle assigned to destroy your labor, assigned to destroy your family, Assigned to destroy your business, assigned to destroy your career. I command them to die in the name of Jesus. Makatendali koyabo shenteraba, ribo sepande koyabo. Every poison of slavery hiding in anybody's glory. I said the poison, the poison of slavery hiding inside anybody's glory. Catch fire in the name of Jesus. Catch fire, 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 catch fire. Light your amen, roar like thunder. Catch fire in the name of Jesus. Seven persons here. The power of God will fall upon you. And you definitely not be able to stand on your feet. Because now this prayer is addressing the root of your trouble. I decree that that village river 
that will not allow you to prosper. I command that river to release you now in the name of Jesus. Be released. 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 In the name of Jesus. That's the first person. That's number two. That's number three. That's number four. That's number five. Number six is on the gallery. That's number seven. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Voices from the grave. Walking against my family. Dead. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree it. In Jesus' name we pray. It's the same prayer you are going to pray again. Now you personalize it to yourself now. Voices from the grave crying against my life. Duh! In the name of Jesus. Jesus name we pray the next voice we wish to silence the voices of witchcraft witchcraft is public enemy number one can you raise up your voices loud and clear voices of witchcraft Walking against my destiny. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Voices of my foundation crying against my destiny. In the name of Jesus. In 
Jesus' name we pray. You will shout this three aggressive times while pointing your finger to the ground. Say, Earth! 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 Can you shout this loud and clear? Hear the word of the Lord. Can I hear you saying this loud and clear? Swallow the enchanters assigned against me. This is a very serious prayer. Because if they have their way, they will bury you too. Sisters, are you here this morning? Sisters, can I hear you shouting this loud and clear? Swallow the enchanters assigned against me. When you say that once, you now begin to command the earth. Swallow them. Swallow them. Swallow them. Swallow them. And as you continue to say it, you'll be amazed at what will begin to happen. Swallow the enchanters assigned against me. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Command the earth to swallow them. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. It's happening. It's happening. It's happening. It's happening. It's happening. That's right. In Jesus' name we pray. Oh, wonderful. Thank you, Jesus. I want you to put more fire in your press now. There are some enchanters. They are busy looking at people's life in their crystal ball. They have satanic mirrors they are using to monitor people. Shout this with only anger. Crystal ball of the enemy. Explode in their faces. In the name of Jesus, speak against the crystal ball. That's right. There must be no room for negotiation. No negotiation. In Jesus' name we pray. Look at what is happening now. That's right. I someone here, they've been monitoring you for years. And anytime you want to approach a breakthrough, they pull you back. But that is the end. Because their crystal ball has exploded in their faces. Sisters, say this after me loud and clear. Any power calling for my head before an evil mirror. Can you say that loud and clear? Is that the loudest the sisters can say it? Die with the mirror! That's right. They must die with the mirror. In Jesus' name we pray. We are making good progress. Very good progress. Someone is here. You are from the Riverine area. Every morning there is this association of native doctors who chant against you there are about 14 of them but within the next one week you will hear the news that their associations have been scattered say this loud and clear pharaoh of my father's house die in the red sea in the name of Jesus, deal with the Pharaoh. That's right. Command the Pharaoh of your father's house to die in the Red Sea. Yes. Something is happening already. Something is happening already. Yes, 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 yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Oh, yes. Say this with violence. Messengers of affliction. 
carry your message back to the sender. Uh, if you have any infirmity on your body, any affliction, this is the time to do return to sender. Messengers of affliction! Carry your message back to the sender. In the name of Jesus. Deal with the messengers of affliction. Thank you, Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. This next five prayers will release multiple breakthroughs to the life of as many people as who pray them from their hearts. Let your body pray. Let your soul pray. Let your spirit pray. I someone here, even when you don't eat anything, you feel as if you have eaten. The enemy is trying to block your intestine. But right there where you are, the power of God is coming upon you. And that yoke is broken now completely. Some other person there, your parents are dead. But you are being pursued by the powers that pursue them. You have now been completely set free. If you are that person who came here having breathing difficulties. And they begin to talk, tell you stories about your lungs. The power of God is touching you right there where you are. And the yoke of the spirit of death upon your heart and lungs are broken. Check your breathing now. Once you find that that problem has gone. That problem of breathing, you find that it has gone. Just quietly find a way to the altar here. Don't allow the enemy to put it back on you. Don't allow the enemy to put it back on you. Thank you, Jesus. If you are that person here, and sometimes something comes upon you, and you feel like taking off your clothes, right there in the public, right there where you are, the power of God is coming upon your life. And the yoke of that oppressor is broken completely. If you're that person that something disappeared from your body when we started praying just now, and you know you have received a healing from God, don't allow the devil to put it back on you. Just find a way to the altar very quickly so that we can pray with you. These five prayers have blessed millions and millions of people. I'm sure your case will not be an exception to Say this loud and clear. Problems caused by enchantment. Pack your load. Go. In the name of Jesus. Can I hear the sister saying it? Yes. Problems caused by enchantment. Pack your load. Go. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. That's the first one. Number two. Every chain limiting my favor. Break! In the name of Jesus. The chain limiting my favor. Let us change the broken in the name of Jesus. Let the chains be broken. Let the chains be broken. Mosete kepo ya bo shendera bo kontia. Riboso bola kapola kaya bo shendera bo koya ba. Aha 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 aha. Chains limiting my favor. Break 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 break. Break. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Very good. This is number three. Every bondage working against my brain. Can you shout this loud and clear? In the name of Jesus, the bondage was broken. 
Jesus is here. And his power to deliver is moving all over the place. Masikaya bo shendera bo sempola kayaba. The kesentia. Bikasempi nikaya bo si. Ribo soponde keya bo shendera ba. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. In Jesus name we pray. Say so every magic poured on the ground against me backfire in the name of Jesus command them to backfire there must be a backfiring effect spirit of the living God spirit of the living God begin to move upon your people here let the yoke of the enemy be broken, be broken, let it be broken, let it be broken, let it be broken. Just in Jesus' name we pray. That's right. Lord has just done something powerful. The life of somebody there. The enemy has laid his hands on your menstruation, on many things in your life. But those hands have been shaken off now. Someone is here to they have told you that you have cancer. But if we check the place now, find that this the place has dried up and the hand of God has worked on your behalf today. Now this next this, this fifth prayer. Pray it without any apology to any power. Every masquerade assigned to sleep in my house. Can you shout this with only anger? Make sure your voice is louder than that. Make sure you shout it even louder than that. Yeah! In the name of Jesus. Oh, yes. Deal with the mass with that signed. The power of God begin to move. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. I want to congratulate all those who pray those five prayer points. Glory be to the name of Jesus. Seventeen persons that have been tied down in the spirit realm. And this is why you are not moving forward. Right there where you are. The power of God has just released you. From the powers that have tied you down. That's the first person. Number two. Number three. Number four. Number five. Number six. Number seven. Number eight. Number nine. Number ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Number fourteen. Yes, that's the power of God. That's the power of God. Number fifteen. Number sixteen. And number 17. That's right. They, they've tied you down in the spirit. Now you have been released. That's right. An evil wind blew into somebody's eyes. And your eyes have been partially blind since then. Check those eyes now. you find that they are now seeing clearly. That's right. Yes. Once you notice that, just find a way to the frontier. Find a way to the frontier. Thank you, Jesus. You, the spirit of arthritis, the spirit of diabetes, and the spirit of high blood pressure, your time is up. Let this person go. Let this person go. In the name of Jesus. That's it. You have been released. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Uh, I a woman here. Actually, the fact that you are here is the grace of God because you also can testify that your body has been completely shared out by witchcraft powers. You saw them clearly in your dream. But right there where you are, your strength has come back now. And all the organs have been returned. That's right. And then you are, you are strong now. 
Just find a way to the altar here. This person has been vomiting blood, urinating blood, and losing blood. Check that evil flow now. It has ceased. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Some people here today, you are in business. Where the enemy has sent an evil clock to be regulating your life. That clock has just been destroyed. I'm beginning from this morning. You shall have uncommon prosperity. Thank you, Jesus. Say this loud and clear now. Every power abolishing enchantments against me. Can you shout this loud and clear? Shout it louder than that, beloved. Death! In the name of Jesus. Oh, yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, yes. 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 Yes, yes, yes. In Jesus' name we pray. This is wonderful. I have a message for somebody over there. Your customers that were diverted away by a demonic competitor, they've now been redirected back to you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. An evil letter has been sent to somebody. The letter will be replaced by promotion letters. Yeah. Now the next three prayers. Make sure that nobody's voice overshadows your own. Somebody over there has been in from a blood infirmity. And there is someone over there too. You came here quite early this morning. You've done operations several times. They ask you to come and do another one. But the power of God is touching you where you are. And the yoke of that infirmity is broken completely. These three prayers, make sure you pray them with holy anger. Powers of the night that is afflicting my destiny. Can you shout it loud and clear? In the name of Jesus. That's right. That's right. Mosekaya bo shendera bo kosontonde ke yaba. Rebo le kosente yaba. Yes, 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 yes. Powers of the night that is afflicting my destiny. In Jesus' name we pray. Aha. That's right. That's right. Silence. Silence. I see arrows going back to a particular village. From where it has been sent to a particular person. And you that person. That house of wickedness, they have redrawn the map of your life. Power has changed hands now. Say, terror of the night. I'll sign against my destiny. Scatter. Yeah, deal with the terror of the night. I'll sign against your destiny. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. Moseketenda kayabo sapolabo. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you, Jesus. If you are at this altar here and somebody has spoken to you already, you may go back to your seat. But if nobody has spoken to you, just stay. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Raise your right hand to the heavens now.
Every enchantment assigned against my life. In the heavens. Scatter. In the name of Jesus. Masopola Katendekea. In Jesus name we pray. Thank you Jesus. Lord, I cover the miracles of this morning with the blood of Jesus. And I decree that affliction will not rise again a second time. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Pick a song of praises in your mouth now and begin to sing it loud and clear to the King of Kings and to the Lord of Lords. To him who is able to do all things. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise him who can do all things. Praise him who has all powers in his hand. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. We have several more prayers to pray. And the Lord still has a lot of things to do here today. All eyes closed. If you are that person, and something comes upon you in the night to squeeze your waist, and by the next morning there is serious trouble, the power of God is coming upon you where you are and the yoke of the night oppression is broken completely that's right the stubborn migraine represented by a satanic lizard is being taken out of the head of somebody if you shake that head now you'll find that the migraine has gone that's right the Lord has just taken something out of the breast of somebody. Stretch your two hands forward now. As if you want to receive something back. Every good thing. Stolen from me by enchanters. I recover you by fire. In the name of Jesus. Begin to recover it. Maseka tunda kaya boshende raboko soponde kaya. In Jesus' name we pray. Now lay one hand on your head, the other one on your belly button, and let your amen be dynamic now. Father, in the name of Jesus, I stand here as a servant this morning. And I speak against every inherited enchantment. I speak against every enchantment assigned against the head. I stand against every enchantment from the waters. I stand against every enchantment from the jungles. I stand against every enchantment from any witch doctor. You enchantments, lose your hold in the name of Jesus. Lose your hold. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Everything you have lost. Recover them now. Recover them now. Sevenfold. Recover them sevenfold. Recover them. Recover them. Recover them. Recover them. Recover them. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. That's right. And let's raise up our right hand to the heavenly. As we begin to pray these ceiling prayers. On what God has done our, in our lives here today. There are people here this morning. Who will be so shocked by what the Lord will do. That they will open their mouths in wonder. But meanwhile. 
pray this prayer from your heart. Every power planning to disgrace me. You are a liar. Can you declare this loud and clear? In the name of Jesus. Deal with any power that wants to disgrace you. I refuse to be disgraced. In Jesus name we pray. Let me ask you a question. How many of you here today want the blessing of God to pursue and overtake you? Then pray this prayer violently. Every good thing that I've been running after. Begin to run after me now. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and declare that one. Let them begin to pursue and overtake you. In the name of Jesus. Aha. In Jesus name we pray. So every power. That does not want me to lift my head. Catch fire. In the name of Jesus. Deal with the power that does not want you to lift your head. My head must be lifted up above my enemies round about me. Yes, in Jesus' name we pray. As a pregnant woman who came here crying because of what the doctor has told you. But I have a message for you from the Lord that everything that doctor has said about you forget it because the power of God has overruled and we are going to wait for your testimony sir. thank you Jesus say oil of favor baptize my life in the name of Jesus as for a baptism of the oil of favor oil of favor baptize my life in Jesus name we pray say this loud and clear say, from us from now on no one will say to me sorry try again next time in the name of Jesus open your mouth and declare it. I shall be an all round success in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Say this, O oh God, Allah, and let the company of sorcerers scatter. In the name of Jesus, scatter the congregation of the sorcerers. I stand against your life, I stand against your destiny. In Jesus' name we pray. Citations of darkness into my life. Is that the loudest you can say it? In the name of Jesus. Deal with the visitations. Masopika tonde ke yabo shente raba. Bonaka tenda ka yabo shente. It's up already. That's right. Bosekaya <laughs> 
the apostle of his joys he said to me Makosa Ponte Rabo Shente Rapoli Katende Kesente Deneke Pende Yaba Yes Yes, 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 yes In Jesus name we pray Let there be silence now Silence completely The Lord said there are people here tonight as a result of visitations of darkness some infirmities have entered into their lives right now the infirmities that have entered as a result of the evil visitation the one that is ringing in the center of the head the one that is causing heaviness on the head the one that is causing cloudiness in the eyes the one that is causing arthritis in the legs the one that is causing evil swelling in parts of the body the one that is causing some parts of the body to start behaving strangely. The one that is causing the evil swelling in parts of the body. The one that is causing cobwebs surrounding the face. The one that is causing paralysis. Right there where you are. The plantation that was planted during the visitation. According to the word of God that every tree that the father has not planted. Shall be rooted and thrown into the fire. Those things have been uprooted now. And they are being thrown into the fire. They are being uprooted. They are being thrown into the fire. They are being uprooted. They are being thrown into the fire. They are being uprooted. They are being thrown into the fire. They are being uprooted. They are being thrown into the fire. In the name of Jesus. What's happening? Check your body now. Check your body now. Check that material moving about in your waist. Check that neck that the enemy has fired an arrow into. Check that breast to discover that the evil swelling there has gone. Check under your feet to see that that plantation of the enemy has disappeared. Check the anea to see that it has vanished. What's happening all over the place. Because they came as a, as a result of visitation of darkness. Silence. Check your body properly. Properly. Immediately you find that the Lord has removed that plantation of infirmity. Please don't allow the devil to put it back on you. Just quietly find a way to the altar here. I didn't ask you to come out if you want to be prayed for. No, 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 no. But God has touched you and I want to, put, want to pray for you to put a seal on that miracle. So that the enemy will not bring it back. Just find a way quietly here now to the altar. Thank you, Jesus. Every property of the enemy in my life catch fire in the name of Jesus. That's right. Command the property of the enemy to catch fire. Tonight is tonight. You must not go home. With any property of darkness. That's why Jesus brought you here. Masopoko tende kata. Maria boko sotende ke ya bo shente raba. Manari bo sotende ke ya bo shente raba. Aha, 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 aha. Something is happening again. Every property of the enemy in my life. Catch fire! 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 Maseka tenda kaya bo shende raboka, bori deke se tende kaya bo shente raba, manare aloko sepa. Maloka tende ke ya bo shente ra bo kora ba. Ma sente ke ya bo shente ra ba. Yes, 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 yes. Aha, 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 aha.
The fire is burning. The fire is burning. In Jesus' name we pray. Things are happening again. Check that stomach trouble you brought here. Find that the arrow of infirmity there had backfired. This person has been losing blood very aggressively. Go and check now. That evil blood flow has stopped. Just check your body and quietly find a way to the altar here. The prayer we are going to pray now, the Lord will use it to lift many out of whatever situation the enemy has put them. Oh God, arise! And let the root of my problems die! In the name of Jesus! Yes, let the root of my problems die. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Let your power move in an awesome manner. Let your power move in an awesome manner. Let your power move in an awesome manner. Masika pola kaya bo shenteraba. Banaribo sopende kaya bo shenter. Te setende kaya bo shenter abokopola baraba. Thank you Jesus, thank you Jesus, thank you Jesus, thank you Jesus. Thank you Jesus, thank you Jesus. Yeah, receive a lifting up by the power of the Holy Ghost. Receive a lifting up by the power of the Holy Ghost. Receive a lifting up by the power of the Holy Ghost. Receive a lifting up by the power of the Holy Ghost. Receive a lifting up by the power of the Holy Ghost. Receive a lifting up by the power of the Holy Ghost. Receive a lifting up by the power of the Holy Ghost. Thank you, Jesus. Katenda ya boshandia, ribo sepela kaya boshendera ba santa ya ba, na katende ribo sepola kaya boshente. Amen. I decree upon your life over there that every curse that has hijacked your family history be broken now. In the name of Jesus. Every curse of infirmity, every spirit of infirmity, every curse of stagnancy, every spirit of stagnancy, every curse of frustration, every spirit of frustration, every embargo of darkness, I command it to scatter now in the name of Jesus. silence. I can see the hand of God moving from person to person. Yes. Every arrow of darkness in the body, your time is up. The ones in the eyes, the ones in the head, the one in the chest, the one in the womb, the one in the two legs, arrows of darkness, arrows of the enemy, plantation of darkness, plantation of the enemy, Hear the word of the Lord. It is written, as soon as they hear of me, they shall obey me. Strangers that submit themselves unto me, the strangers shall be afraid, and they shall flee out of their close places. You, the strangers in the close places, get out now in the name of Jesus. silence 
at the count of seven from here, all those who are in this gathering, and there is a rope of witchcraft around your waist. They control you. They drag you here and there. When you are about to approach a breakthrough, they apply the rope and pull you back. I'm going to count seven from here. The power of God is going to follow for such people. And that yoke shall be broken forever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The rope must be broken. The rope must be broken. The rope must be broken. Lay your right hand upon your head now. Lay your right hand upon your head. Father, I pray that the Holy Ghost fire will arise and kill every satanic deposit in anybody's head here. Anyone watching us, in the name of Jesus. Yes, the deposits have been troubled. It's time for them to go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's right. You are going to shout this seven times. Say, My head. Receive deliverance by fire. In the name of Jesus. Shout it seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Silence now. Check that head now. Check your body too. You brought some infirmities here. You brought some weaknesses here. And they have been shifted back to the camp of the enemy. And you can do what you could not do before. Find a way to the altar very quickly. Don't let the devil put any problem back. Now that it's gone, it's gone for good. Check your head, check your body, check that swelling, check your legs. Do what you could not do before. Run quickly to the altar here. If you cannot run, run. If you cannot walk, walk. If you cannot see, see. If you cannot hear, hear. In the name of Jesus. That's the power of God coming upon you. Aha. Lay, retain your hand upon your head. Say, Power of God. Attack all covens. Assign against my head. In the name of Jesus. Power of God. Attack all covens. Assign against my head. In the name of Jesus. Say three hot times. That's one. That's two. That's three. Amen. That's right. That's right. That's right. Something has been taken out from a woman's body. It's as if they put a heavy load upon your body. But right now, all those loads have been taken off. Check your body now and find a way to this altar. For the next few minutes, I want you to wear your warrior cap. This is the first meeting of the year. And there are prayers I want you to pray. 
There are plenty of prayers, but we have a short time to pray them. It will be a tragedy to keep quiet. It will be a tragedy to be left out. Can you shout this loud and clear? I break every spell upon my life. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to break it. In Jesus' name we pray. Any witch dispatched to my house, I cut you off. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and decree that one to cut them off. In Jesus' name we pray. Say so every power speaking failure to my destiny. You are a liar. Die. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and decree that one to Masepola Kaya Boshendera Basanta. Jesus, then we pray. So powers chanting my name in darkness. Shut up. Da. Shut up. Da. In the name of Jesus. Powers chanting my name in darkness. Silence them. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. My stolen portions. Can you shout this loud? What are you doing in the valley of witchcraft? Can I hear you shouting that? Jesus. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Any sickness that wants to overtake my life. Can I hear the sister say shouting this? Sisters, your voice is not loud enough. Brothers, shout it louder than that. Everybody together now. Down. In the name of Jesus. Something is going on over there. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Stretch your right hand towards this altar. Father, you have promised us that these signs shall follow them that believe. They shall lay their hands on the sick and the sick shall recover. Let the power of recovery, the power of resurrection, the power of breakthroughs, I time to this answer in the name of Jesus. Let this hand become the answer of fire and power. In the name of Jesus. Now, if you have any infirmity in any part of your body, smite the place aggressively. Don't feel sorry for the place. And you shout on it back to your sender. Back to your sender. Let's go!
Do it well, do it well, do it well. Check your body now. That place is smooth. Check your body now. Begin to do what you cannot do. If you cannot walk, walk. If you cannot run, run. If you cannot see, see. If you have any swelling in your body, check it up. And run quickly to this altar. Don't let the devil put the problem back. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Say, I step into my wealthy place by fire. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and decree that one to Calendar of darkness. If you don't want to repeat of any evil history, this is the prayer to shout seriously. Calendar of darkness. Fashioned against my life. Catch fire in the name of Jesus. calendar of darkness Jesus Jesus in Jesus name we pray I'm going to pray for some specific cases now if you have been healed please come out and talk now don't be ashamed. Don't let the devil put it back. They overcame him by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of their testimony. Thank you, Jesus. I'm going to pray for some specific cases. Silence everywhere. Don't say amen until I ask you to say amen. Father, I pray for that, your daughter over there. Some time ago, you were raped. The rapists were occultic people whatsoever they are planted into your body at that time i command them to begin to depart now uh, don't, don't say anything no just keep quiet until i ask you to talk masapia lekatena every plantation of darkness that has entered into your body true sex be released from it now in the name of jesus that's the power Falling upon that person over there. Father, I pray that the power that I used to pin this person lifelessly to the bed, as if your life is flying out. I separate that power from your body now. In the name of Jesus, that is the power of God coming upon you. The power of God is about to come upon somebody. This is the problem. Your grandmother cursed you. Your grandfather also cursed you. That person over there. The power of God is coming upon you. And the evil spiritual garment upon your body is catching fire now. Yes, that's the person over there. Right there where you are. The evil eggs that that prophet gave you to swallow. Vomit them. 
Vomidem, 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 They have aroused your life for too long. Vomidem in the name of Jesus. Now, time for success prayers. Success prayers. Raise up your right hand to the heavens and say what I'm going to say after me. Say, every altar of affliction raised against my success scatter in the name of Jesus. A loud amen. In the name of Jesus. Say, so I break any power of non-achievement of my father's house in the name of Jesus say this year shall be one of my best years on earth in the name of Jesus because as from now I shall not labor in vain as from now men and women shall show me favor in the name of Jesus a sevenfold amen say thank you Jesus say thank you Jesus Father will cover the signs and wonders with the blood of Jesus. And affliction will never rise again. In the name of Jesus. Let's remain standing as you take a song of praises in your mouth and sing it loud and clear to the King of Kings and to the Lord of Lords. Pick any song of praises and sing it loud and clear. Great is the God. How great is His name? How great is His name? All I let's sing. You go back the waters of the mighty Red Sea. I said I never knew. Amen. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood.
2014. Hear the word of the Lord. Can you shout that loud? Make your voice louder than that. Favor me by fire. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Father, open our understanding. Lay your hands upon us. Anoint our mouth. Give us a mouth and a wisdom that the enemy cannot contest against. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Here the sister says, say this after me. Warehouse in the waters. Can the sisters shout is louder? Sisters, I'm sure you can do a lot, lot better than that. Release my virtues. Can I hear the brothers shouting the same thing? That's right. Everybody together now. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to decree. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, Marine witchcraft of my father's house. Your time is up. Dead. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. I'm going to count seven from here. Anyone being controlled by powers from the waters, either mommy water, marine spirit, water spirit, they will be released instantly. The angels of warfare are scattered all over this place to cut every covenant that you have with them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You can't hide. You've been hiding for years. Release our children. Release our husband. Release our wealth. Release it. Release it. In the name of Jesus. You marine husband, lose your hold too. In the name of Jesus. Say this with boiling anger. Say, I release my wealth from the grip of marine bankers by the power in the blood of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree. Release them, release them. In Jesus' name we pray. Say so what I'm going to say after me. 
Say, in faith, I hand over my battle to God. In faith, I come against every evil stronghold of any marine kingdom. In faith, I pollute your water with the blood of Jesus Christ. In faith, I overturn every marine agenda against me. In faith, I trample upon marine serpents and scorpions. In faith, I spoil marine palaces and set our captives free. There shall be no reinforcement or evil reunion of this power against me. I seal my confession with the blood of Jesus. And I cover myself with the blood of Jesus. Amen. A sevenfold amen. If January is your birthday, please remain standing. Father, we thank you for this, your children who are celebrating the birthday in January. Let it be well with them in the name of Jesus. Bless them to a dumbfounding degree. As I celebrate your birthday this month, by this time next year, if Jesus tarries in his coming, you'll be a greater bundle of testimonies in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Bring out your prayer letter for this program now. Those things you want the Lord to do for this year. Hold it to your hand and rise up on your feet. And let your amen be dynamic as I pray now. Stretch the letter towards this altar. As you let your amen be loud and clear. Father, in the name of Jesus. All these letters that of children have written. You know the innermost desire of their hearts. Answer the letter by fire in the name of Jesus. The Lord God that dwelleth in Zion will arise and fight for you in the name of Jesus. And every point you have written in that paper shall become mighty testimonies in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. And therefore, Lord, as many of your people as are gathered here are connected to this program one way or the other, let your angels of wonder, your angels of science, your angels of might, your angels of dominion be released into the midst here to chase out anything that is contrary to anybody's destiny. Let them be released in massive numbers. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. I saw one in this meeting tonight. The operation of occultists and magicians and witch doctors against you shall end in shame. For they will not be able to affect your destiny. That's the first person. I told you, that's the second person. The powers that have caused you to waste many years right there where you are the Holy Ghost we pay the interest on your wasted years. That's the first person again. That's number two. That's number three. Something is about to happen to 50 persons. And they may not be able to stand on their feet. I have a word for you from the Lord. The garment of reproach that has been bordering your destiny has been torn to pieces now. In the name of Jesus. It's number one. It's number two. It's number three. It's number four. It's number five. Number six, number seven, number eight, number nine, number ten. Thank you, Jesus. Silence.
Number 11, 12. 13. Every ancient chain that has tied you down to one spot, every ancient chain of your father's house, of your mother's house, that has tied you down to one spot, is broken now in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Silence. Silence. You, that lady over there, you are walking on the earth, but your destiny, everything that belongs to your life, is walking inside the water. Repair the car, the cartender. Right there where you are, the dedication to the waters that has been controlling your life is broken to pieces in the name of Jesus. Yes. Oh, yes. Tonight is the night of freedom. Release a womb. Release a womb. Release that womb. Release that womb. Release that womb. Release that womb. In the name of Jesus. Within the next 48 hours, that person over there, those goods in your shop that have been unsold, within 48 hours, everything shall be sold out. That's the voice of the Lord for you today. Silence. Perfect silence. If you are not an usher, and you are walking about, you are walking about now at your own detriment. You better stay somewhere. The angels that are moving now are very violent. You are not an usher, don't move about like butterflies here. Yeah. Father, anything that needs to be whipped out, anything that needs to be chased out, anything that needs to be killed for your children to possess their possession and for them to laugh last over their enemies. Let those things die now in the name of Jesus. <laughs> Thank you for this first meeting of the year. And we praise your holy name for your mighty hand of power and strength. You are the mighty man of war, you are the great I am. Accept our thanks in the name of Jesus. <laughs> Father, minister life and power unto your people today in the name of Jesus. <laughs> to you, Father, be the glory. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. 
a louder amen. I say happy new year to you all again in Jesus name. There are powers and there are powers. And who you follow decides what follows you. What you know this decides who knows you it's as simple as that one Jesus said my people perish for lack of knowledge he says you shall know the truth now and the truth you know will set you free the truth is very powerful but the truth is useless to you if you don't know it you shall know the truth and that truth shall set you free there are powers and there are powers but the rule is very simple the rule amongst powers is very simple when a lower power comes against a greater power as a matter of necessity that lower power must bow it's a rule if you are stronger than your enemy the enemy cannot embarrass you this is why the Lord said be strong the Bible says be strong Strong in the Lord. He is strong in the Lord. And one of the reasons he asked us to be strong. Is because we have a strong enemy. That is because we have a strong part of the reason is because we have a strong enemy. When you connect to a power higher than your enemy, the bow. The Bible says, when thou art strong. Strong. And you take the yoke from off your neck. If you are not strong enough, and you are trying to remove the yoke of the enemy, the enemy will come back and put more yoke. So that the person does not escape. There are 21 powers to connect connect to this year for complete success. 21 powers to connect to this year for complete success. That's what we want to discuss. And we go as a spirit leads us and cover what we can cover for today and continue next time. Nobody prays for crisis. Nobody looks for trouble. Nobody wakes up and says, today I want trouble. But unfortunately, the other name for the world is trouble. And the world is a crisis center. The world is a very large psychiatric hospital. It's a, it's a, mad, it's a mad world. And this is why I've been telling you for since about a month ago that it is, it is abnormal to be normal in an abnormal world. When the world is mad and crazy, it's abnormal to be seen in that environment. But this is very, very well. so when things arise, if you pick one of these 21 powers and you connect to it. I'm showing sure my spirit. The Lord will give you victory. What are these 21 powers that we connect to and put our enemies to flight and move the way God wants us to move? I'll take them one by one. The first one is the power of praises. The power of praises. In Exodus chapter 15, verse 11, Exodus 15, verse 11, the 
first power you must connect to this year is the power of praises. Exodus 15, 11. If you are there, say yes. That passage is the origin of one of our most popular praises and worship songs. Which says, Who is lying unto thee? Oh, who is lying unto thee? Oh,
changes a man. Amen. The Bible says, Bibeli, we pray. When we praise God, He's glorious in holiness. Ologo, fearful in praises. Elero, ni. He doeth wonders. God becomes a terror to our enemies when we praise Him. This is what the word of God says. In Psalm 149, verse 6. Psalm 149, verse 6. So let the high praises of God be in their mouth. And a two edged sword in their hands. To execute vengeance upon the heathen. And punishment upon the people. Please note this powerful scripture. They are telling you things about praises. In Psalm 22, verse 3. Psalm 22, verse 3. We're talking about powers to connect to this year. And so, ni pa wak para to yeka soko moni no dui. Twenty-two verse three. Orinda fili keji leli ogun eseketa. Psalm twenty-two verse three says this. Orinda fili keji leli ogun eseketa. But thou art holy. So bon mimo ni wo. O thou that inhabitest the praises of Israel. Eneti o te in Israel do. But thou art holy. So bon mimo ni wo. O thou that inhabitest the praises of Israel. And it will tell in Israel it do. Paul and Silas. Paul and Silas. Went out to minister. What did the Lord let you say? They did not go of their own accord. We lot no one law more law from around. It was not their personal decision to go and preach. He said, "Queen, we are going to let law us or Lord." God said, "Go there." Or Lord, Lord, we pay law see them. And they went there. What the Lord said? Immediately they arrived in the place. They get there to one day. They just want the first convert. One convert said, "Jerry, you can come." After the first convert, they just want to Jerry. They captured them. On bamu, they dragged them on the floor. On one one nail. They wounded them. They beat them. And they put them in the innermost dungeon in the prison. A very, very disappointing treatment. For those who went out to serve God, they were not there to serve the devil. These men had a right. So, well, God, we came here to serve you. We came here to preach. We sat down there. We open your eyes. We allow all this to happen. Why serve you anyway? But the Bible says, at midnight, Paul and Silas, they connected to this power I'm trying to explain to you. The Bible says at midnight, Paul and Silas sang praises to God and they prayed. And they got connected to God. And then the earthquake of deliverance started. When you praise God, the enemy is unhappy. Because no one is happy when they are praising his enemy before him. Praises is a battle axe. A weapon of war. When next you find yourself overwhelmed, why don't you declare Declare a period of marathon praise. It is possible to pray, pray, sometimes and pray amiss. But you cannot praise amiss. The tongue of praise has no time to gossip. If Christians praise God more, His wonders will explode more. Unfortunately, many of us don't take praises seriously. Sometimes someone will say, well, they have not started the service, they are just singing praises. Actually, that period of praises is the high point of the service. God inhabits the praises of his people. God loves 
praise because it gives voice to our own faith. Olorun ferun eyin nitori po ma fun igbagbo wa ni ohun. And it's a powerful weapon. O si ji ohun elo to lagbara. Paralyzes the devil. O si ma mu atayaro. Or shouts in the presence of God. Am I jacking your mu asi waju Olorun? God inhabits the praises. Nitori pe Olorun ma gbe ninu yi. So for those of you who don't like singing praises go and learn the songs. Ori nu eyin te o ferun lati ma ko rin e ma ko. Those who don't have him books go and buy your him books. Eyin te o ni iwe oni e lo ra iwe ori learn how to praise God. Yes, you, call. you will certainly need to connect to this power this year. Praises will bring God into situations. It will make the harm of God to arise for yourself. And as lovely as it is, it is also a weapon of violence. For God himself is a man of war. And God is enthroned inside the praises of his own people. And when you praise God, it's also an act of faith. Whether you feel okay, don't feel okay, that the situation is terrible, the situation is good. It does not matter. Break forth into a period of marathon praise. And watch that praise melt away your discouragement. When you are praising God, you are announcing the greatness of God. He in turn will release power to meet our needs. There must be a mystery and a reason. Why praises, why praises is the highest occupation of angels in heaven. There must be a reason. So when we praise him, we join up with those voices in heaven. Satan. Satan is allergic to people praising God. And he doesn't like it at all. I pray for you that you will understand the deep, the deepness and the depth of this matter. And how that faith is a detergent, a purifying agent. Purifies your faith, purges your doubts. And exhausts God in your life. So the first power to connect to this year is the power of praise. What is the first power? Can you say that again? Can you say that again? The second power that you must connect to this year is the power of prayer. The Bible says men ought always to pray and not faint. It didn't say men ought always to preach or teach. It said men ought always to pray and not cease. Anna prayed. And we ought to start praying Anna style now. Anna pray like a drunken person. We need to start praying like drunk, drunk people. Elijah prayed like a warrior. We need to start praying like that too. Jesus, Jesus prayed on his, his sweated blood. We need to start praying Jesus style too. Jabez prayed the kind of prayer that turned the tide of his life. People pray in the Bible. They use prayer to separate waters. They use prayers to raise the dead. They use prayers to cause the enemy to depart. Men ought always to pray. And not faint. Everything we do in the house of God. The devil can do better. He can sing, he can dance, he can preach, he can teach. In fact, the devil 
is the best pastor. Because he knows the address of every one of his members. But one thing he cannot do is to pray. And so once the devil wants to deal with a Christian, the first thing he removes is your prayer life. Once that prayer life is gone, that's it. I'm praying for you today. And the anointing of prayer to get results will fall upon you in the name of Jesus. Let that amen rule like thunder. Many are praying for big breakthroughs. Their, their prayer altar is not strong enough to take the breakthrough they are asking for. There are so many powers, I don't want them to possess it. So as you increase your strength in prayers, you, you increase your breakthrough too. Many will not be able to assess the breakthrough God asked for them. Police say four or four or Latin or Latin call on real law or to a lot of them for one until they have obtained a certificate in the school of prayer. Teaching wolf you by where the poor cack of boy nearly we are Dora only goes to trust them in prayer. A minimum of one year of a lot of bad. So, what is the first part to connect to? We're not kidding about a kid to your casuara for more and the second one, the cage, the third power, the keta is the power of agreement. Only Agbara if you must shock on agreement if you must shock on in Genesis chapter 11. Anyway, Genesis you read Kokola verse 6. I say Kefa Genesis 11 6. In the Genesis you read Kokola, I say Kefa. Please listen carefully to this third one that I'm telling you. Genesis 11 6. In the Genesis you read Kokola, I say Kefa. And the Lord said, Behold, the people is one. And they have all one language. And this they begin to do. And now nothing will be restrained from them. In Genesis, which they are imagine to do. There is power in agreement. The Lord said, These people I'm looking at. This kind of agreement within them. You can't stop them. Now to now bring it home to us. In the New Testament. Matthew chapter 18. Matthew or Kajidini Ogun was 18. Matthew 18, 18. Matthew or Kajidini Ogun. This is an important scripture. An important scripture. An important scripture. Matthew 18 18. Very name I say unto you, whatsoever ye shall bind on earth, shall be bound in heaven. And whatsoever ye shall lose on earth, shall be lose in heaven. Look at verse 19. Again, I say unto you, that if two, two of you shall agree. Shall agree. Shall agree. On earth. As touching anything. Are you following the scripture? An agreement on anything. anything. That he shall ask. It shall be done. He didn't say it may be so done. It shall be done for them. Of my father, which is in heaven. For two or three. I gather together. Again, agreement. Agreement. In my name. There am I. In the midst of them. The Bible says. One. Which is a thousand. But you will have thought that two. Which is two thousand. Say one. Which is a thousand. Two. 
10,000. So you can see that by just agreeing, they have multiplied strength. This is why I'm standing here as a prophet of the Lord this morning. And I agree with you that you shall prosper. I agree with you. you shall pursue your pursuers. I agree with you. No weapon from against you shall prosper. I agree with you. Everywhere you go, favor shall follow you. I agree with you. That you shall be celebrated. You shall be celebrated. You shall be, you shall be celebrated. You shall be decorated. You shall be celebrated. You shall be decorated. In the name of Jesus. I agree with you. Everywhere they mention your name for evil this year. Fire shall come out about them. I agree with you. Breakthrough will pursue and locate you. In the name of Jesus. Shout a loud amen. Shout a loud amen. Now join your hand with the hand of somebody. Hold somebody in the hand. Somebody. Hold the person in the hand. One to one. Hold that person in the hand. And you will decree that by the power of agreement you shall prosper. In the name of Jesus. I agree with that person. I agree with the person. In Jesus' name we pray. Keep, keep your hands joined to that person. Keep that up and join. Father, Father, Baba, as your children have agreed now, I decree that heavens will over answer your prayer. In the name Jesus. Let that heaven rule like thunder. Let's go on a little bit further. What is the first power you should connect to? And the second one? The cage. And the third one? The That's why it's not good for you to sit there. You to be in a household, you don't pray in that house. No prayer in the house. No family prayer. No friendly prayer. Nothing. Anyone living in the, under the same roof must pray together. When his husband and wife is even stronger. The fourth power to connect is the power of sowing. You sow. You sow. Remember that woman that kept sowing. 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 Until one day this woman I've been looking after men of God. Second Kings. Built a place. Oh, koi sowing. She kept sowing. Until God gave her something that money cannot buy. Titi, Anyone who is sowing. Any can to one day have sowing. A major breakthrough. It's, the principle is very simple. The Bible says Isaac sold in the time of famine. He, he had nothing but he sold. And when the returns came back, it was outstanding. Very, very outstanding. That is something you must not forget. So seeds into the things of God. Don't wait for somebody to tell you so, 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 so. No, no. You you so, so say what the Lord will do for so you. you. So what is power number one? Kini Agbara Kini. Two. Ikeji. Three. Iketa. Four. Ikeri. Power of soil. 
5 is the power of prophecy agbara isotele the power of prophecy agbara isotele prophecy isotele is miracle in advance o ni ke ise iyarun ti yan foju sona si a miracle in advance ise iyanu ojo ola prophecy isotele is a revelation of what god has already finished in the spirit realm o ni fi won ti olorun ti pari ni ipele ti emi prophecy isotele elisha elisha when there was famine nigbati yan wa he prophesied oh no so tell it very crazy prophecy uh, we so tell it to that be so no tell it to see we it's like there is no food no nothing in nigeria now oh that e ko ma si o nje lori de nigeria ni si and the prophet rose and said by this time tomorrow oh li wa de oni ni wo yi ojo ola a bag of rice i sell for 2 naira ah o ma ta ko ire si kon ni naira it's as crazy as that what the man was saying or already abi oro asin we bi o se n tin so elisha prophesied the seemingly impossible thing elisha o so tell it ni ko nkan to da be n pe ko le and it happens so this year don't take prophecy lightly tori na ninu odun yin e ma fi owo ye pere mu isotele take it lightly at all e ma fo ye pere murara not only that e si wa se be nikan improve your spiritual life e o a je ki igbe aye temi to the level to the level that apostle paul was talking about see pele ti apostle paul o so nipa re he said beloved oni olofe i wish that all of you could prophesy e ba won mi ki gbogbo ile ma so tele everybody ki e gbogbo that is one spiritual gift in the bible everybody can have it everybody, everybody can have the gift of prophecy so when you start with personal prophecy on your life you come to the house of god you hear prophecies i begin to receive them things began to happen things will begin to happen it was many years back lopo lopo odun seyin ni many many years back lopo lopo odun seyin i was in the late 90s we are be odun 1990s to fe ka senle i was in abuja ilu abuja ni mo wa and we used to hold meetings there as man si awon ipade ni be mountain of fire then ni gbo ori o ka se inu ni gba ina ni be i was about leaving the pulpit mo fe fi ori aga iwa su sile and the lord said son ni oluwa so pe omo like someone here eni kon wa ni o to je wi pe is been troubled by serpent ti e ju n da la mu tell the person e so fun eni na and as from today be lati oni lo serpent is dead e ju na ti ku i was on my way away from the people that came back mo fe kuro lori aga iwa su mo to pada wa there is someone here oluwa so pe eni kon wa ni a lady arabirin as a serpent troubling you e ju kon wa to n da la mu the serpent is dead lo ni ni e ju na ti do ku well oda A few people said a few people said amen and when your dear losha me see us one lady at the back also said amen arabirin kan wa leyin ninu ijo nbe o na se ami as of the time we were having that meeting nigba ta n se ipade ta n so yi she was 39 years old she was still a virgin omodun mokan de logoji ni wundi as do je the men don't show interest in her at all ko ti e won okun ni o ti e n wu odo re rara she lived in this high rise building in abuja she's on the i think she was on the fourth floor ni awon le olele gogoro to wa ni ilu abuja bo ya express test kerin right in the center of the city no forest no bush yen la rin ilu gidigidi ni ko si gbo ko si nkan kan nibe so she got home o ba dele she entered into her bedroom o ba wo inu yara ibosun re father i thank you for taking me to the meeting baba mo dupe po mu mi lo sinu ipade but as you looked bo se wo something was sleeping on her bed nkan kan du bule sori ibosun re She was afraid. Eruba, and the thing was covering itself with a uh, cover clothes. Oh, you know what? Well, fi ashobora re, ofi bo ara re lara. So she wanted to run out. Oko kofe salo, but something said to her. Oko oko kon sofun. How can you be coming from a mountain of fire and miracles ministry prayer meeting? Are you afraid? Ba olu se ma bola ti ni ipadi adura ori oke ni adise yanu teru wa nbo. So she tiptoed to the bed. Oba yo lo si bi busun yi. Took the cover cloth. Oba mu ashobora yi. Took the wash. Lo si Beloved, Olufe, on that bed was a large python. Lori busui ni jula, jula snake. Ejo, toto bigi digi. With the head on a pillow. But Lori ejo, Lori Rory Arabiri. But the snake was dead. Ejo, you know what you call? She screamed. Okay, be. And called the neighbors. Oh, she called the neighbors. The neighbors were afraid too. Eruba, the neighbors were afraid too. Eruba, the neighbors were afraid too. 
it was not a question of take away the snake. Take away the snake. No, you could. It's drag away the snake. They drag the snake. They the snake. From my bedroom. Then this lady learned for the first time in her life that every night she slept on that bed, there was another entity sleeping with her on that bed. She was married to a serpent. And she, she didn't know. Within three months, this sister was now properly married. After that serpent died. This is why I'm prophesying into your life. Any power that has made it a full time work to disturb you shall be buried alive. In the name of Jesus. That amen is not loud enough. I prophesy into your life that you shall soar like eagle. In the name of Jesus. Let's continue a little bit further. How many powers have I told you now? What is the first one? Kini, Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. So when you come to a service and you are hearing prophecies even if it doesn't concern you you better Connect, connect to it. Connect to it. Because sometimes God goes to meet the need of one person. But when he sees the heart of another person, you catch the overflow. Six. The power of decree. Decree. The power of decree. The book of Job. It was Job. Chapter twenty-two. Ori keji leli ogun. Verse twenty-eight. Job 22 28 Thou shalt also decree a thing and what will happen it shall be established and the light shall shine upon thy words the power of what? There is a difference between prophecy and decree. For prophecy to be fulfilled, it requires faith of the one receiving that prophecy. But when God moves to the level of decrease, the fulfillment of a decree does not depend on the recipient at all. It depends completely on the power of the one making that decree. Nothing to do with whether you believe or you don't believe. It's the power of the one issuing the decree. What he says here, thou shall also decree a thing. It was it be more own cockpit, and it shall be established unto thee. Yosefi, the mole for, and the light shall shine upon thy ways. A mole, Yosef, mossy, power, no re. Power of decrees. He has also given you that power to issue decrees. Which is completely different from prophecy. Right there where you are, can you raise up your right hand to the Everest? And shout this louder than anyone around you. I decree upon my life that I 
Daniel Olukoya. Pay me Christopher Olumuywa. Shall arise and shine. Oh, the day was it on. Shall arise and shine. Oh, the day was it on. Shall arise and shine. Oh, the day was it on. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and say it again. Like we get to we let go see. Jesus' name we pray. Finally, before we go home, let's speak the seventh one. The power of blessing. Blessing. If you are a careful reader of the Bible, you will read and God blessed Abraham. And God blessed Isaac. And God blessed Jacob. You will have read the story of Jacob in your Bible. Who held on to that angel? And it was only one prayer request. Say, except you bless me, I will not let you go. All Jacob was asking for was blessing. Only book. A blessing. Say unless you bless me. I will not let you go. Say let me go, Jacob. The day is coming. No. Except you bless me. I will not let you go. Beloved, there is power in blessing. The blessing is the opposite of curses. Blessing is a force. Walking positively for you. The Jews have a habit of blessing their children at least once a week. They bless them. They bless them. Many people don't understand what's going on in America. How God blesses them. You will find all over the place sometimes God bless America. God bless America. God bless America. God bless America. Everywhere you see, you find it. When that blessing comes upon you, it is a marathon of good things. Blessing is a force. It works positively for you. Blessing is to, for you to be greeted with success. Where others are encountering failure. Blessing is a positive spiritual energy. That can only come through verbal pronouncements. Verbal pronouncements. Even it has gone to another level now. Scientists have discovered science and when people plant crops they plant crops and they are talking to those plants they are blessing the plants it grows, it grows better blessing is a divine mandate given blessing is a divine mandate given to angels to prosper your way given to angels to prosper your way blessing is for you to enjoy progress and favor blessing is for you to enjoy to enjoy an open heaven. Blessings for you to walk with corresponding fulfillment. To have promotion, promotion galore. Blessings is for you to become a terror to the powers of darkness. God wants to bless all of us. We need to connect to the power of that blessing. We need to form the habit of laying hands on our heads and blessing ourselves in the name of the Lord. You you bless yourself in the name of the Lord. A man is a blessing. A man is a blessing. In a bed of gold. Is laying on a bed of gold. But has terrible disease. It's not blessed. 
But the servants changing the bed sheet. So one and one more door. Don't pass your show you busui. Who is in health? Is still the richest man in the room. There are blessings of health, blessings of emotion, blessings of the soul, blessings of health and healing. So anyone who is blessing you, without using the name of the Lord, is practicing witchcraft. Such blessing will not bring you anything. There is nothing like bless you just somebody will look at us and say bless you bless you bless you, bless you. you. but there is the Lord bless you there is nothing like take care the Bible says be careful for nothing take care means be anxious be, be cautious be cautious be sensitive Care is worry. So take care is almost similar to a curse. So when somebody tells you, bless you, please say, God bless me. God is God bless me. He says, be careful for nothing. But in everything by prayer and supplication, let your request be known unto God. Lay your own right hand on your head. And begin to bless yourself in the name of the Lord. Bless yourself with all kinds of blessings. And come into your spirit. Bless yourself in the name of the Lord. So I bless myself in the name of the Lord. And I will bless my God in my covenant. The Lord will make his face to shine upon me. He will be gracious unto me. He will be gracious unto me. you in the name of the Lord. You're going, you're coming out shall be blessed. The Lord blesses you from Zion. And make his face to shine upon you. And be gracious unto you. You shall trample upon every serpent and scorpion. Upon every part of the enemy. Thank you, Jesus. Raise up your right hand to the heavenlies. I know what you see. No, I'll say in this year. Blood of Jesus. Laminate my life. Open your mouth and decree it loud and clear. Laminate my life. In Jesus' name we pray. As you go, I cover you with the blood of Jesus. This week, your breakthrough shall be outstanding. This month, the Lord will show you uncommon favor. All the prayer requests here, O Lord, answer them by fire. Jesus, mighty name we pray. Thank you for listening to us this evening. See you next month in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ.
Don't miss the February Facebook Meet Month Outreach. Now come back to one day. Now come back to one day. Of transforming messages and life-changing prayers. One day of transforming messages. 15th of February, 2023. Just one day. Live with Dr. D.K. Olukoya. Let the glory begin. Clock, clock, clock in. 11 p.m. 11 o'clock. 11 o'clock. W.A.T. Name of Jesus. Mountain of Fire and Miracles Ministries. Surely the Lord is here. Arise and show me the secrets of my life in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and show me the secrets of my life in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and show me the secrets of my life in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and show me the secrets of my life in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and show me the secrets of my life in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and show me the secrets of my life in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and show me the secrets of my life in the name of Jesus. In Jesus, they we pray. Amen. So, oh God, arise and show me my heavenly identity card in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and show me my heavenly identity card in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and show me my heavenly identity card in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and show me my heavenly identity card in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and show me my heavenly identity card in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and show me my heavenly identity card in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So, Holy Spirit, reveal myself to me in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, reveal myself to me in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, reveal myself to me. Reveal myself to me. Reveal myself to me. Holy Spirit, reveal myself to me. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. My sister, my brother, if you know for sure that there is an array of powers of darkness gathered against you. These are the most effective kind of prayers you can pray. You know that where you come from, wickedness is the order of the day. Then, these are the most effective kind of prayers you should pray. Say this after me, sisters. Every power, Every power. spending the night to pull me down. Can the sister say this with only anger? I don't like the aggression of the sisters to do. <laughs> yes. That's better. Brothers, can you shout it louder than the sister? Oh, son! Throw them away. Can you say this loud and clear? Uh huh. In the name of Jesus, let this one throw them away. In the name of Jesus, Pia da sete kaya boshenta, ribo soponde kaya boshenta rabo kopola ba. If you are spending the night to pull me down, let this one throw you away. Yes, continue, 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 continue. Aha, 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 those 12 sisters, thing is happening now. That's the first person. That's the second person. That's number three. That's number four. Number five. Number six. Number seven. Number eight. Number nine. Number ten. Number eleven. And number twelve. Yes. It's happening. The sun must throw them away. be released from the grip of the marine powers be released now in the name of Jesus you open your mouth like fire again all day 
And give me my portion. In the name of Jesus. Collect your portion. In the name of Jesus. Oh, there arise. Give me my portion. Give me my portion. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, all day arise and cast any power stealing my portion. stealing my portion in the name of Jesus any power stealing my portion let it cast them in the name of Jesus in Jesus name we pray <laughs> I wish you could see what is happening now there is confusion in the heavens that's right raise up your voice like fire again every wicked power in the second heavens that is representing my family can you say this with hot anger? Uh huh. In the sacred. Ja! In the name of Jesus. Uh huh. Open your mouth, beloved. Something must happen. Something must happen tonight. Pasekate abosent. Yes. Enough is enough. Be released. 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 In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Every rod of affliction from the second heavens. Can you shout this loud and clear? Jesus, break the rod of affliction in the name of Jesus. Masikate yabo shente yabo koraba. Ribo soponde ke yabo ko shente yabo koraba. Mapala boko sete yabo ko shente. Ria pa la kasete yabo. Yes, 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 open your mouth, open your mouth, break the rod of affliction, 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 Masikatea Boshen Teraba. Thank you, Jesus, thank you, Jesus. Jesus.
Jesus name we pray Aha. you don't say this loud and clear bullets from heaven can you shout this loud and clear can you say it louder than this can you shout it even louder than that Jesus Yes, yes That's right In Jesus name we pray Say this even louder than what you have been saying here since That wants to kill me. Yeah. In the name of Jesus, kill the problem tonight. Let the problem die tonight. In the name of Jesus, let the problem die. Let the problem die. In the name of Jesus. Aha, 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 Speaking against me with satanic anointing. Can you say it louder than that? Oh, son! Transfer their arrows back to them. Can I hear the sister say what I just said? Every mouth. Every mouth speaking against me with satanic anointing. Oh, son, transfer their arrows back to them. Sisters, now say it loud and clear. Brothers, shout it louder than the sisters. Them we pray. Every arrow of ancestral witchcraft. Can you say it with only anger? Damn! In the name of Jesus. Jesus, thank you, Jesus. In Jesus, then we pray. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 
sing this song loud and clear to celebrate what the Lord has just done here now. Sing this song loud and clear. Victorious, yes, we are victorious. Glory be to God who has given us victory. We are victorious. He made the blind to see. He made the cripple walk. Hallelujah! Yes. Yes. Three prayer points before we go home. Everything stolen from my life by the powers of the night. I repossess you by fire. In the name of Jesus. Whatever they have stolen, repossess it. In Jesus name we pray the power of polygamous witchcraft the in the name of Jesus that's right name we pray affliction of the day in the name of Jesus deal with that affliction affliction of the day command them to be dismantled and to be destroyed in Jesus name we pray Father, Baba, as many of your children here now, let every ancient chain and yoke be broken forever. In the name of Jesus. Now, get yourself ready. Plenty of prayers in a few minutes. But the admonition I have for you that if you pray this prayer use your voice you have made a good bargain but if you pretend as if you are a gentleman a gentlewoman forgetting the scripture that says as from the days of John the Baptist God suffered violence. Can you shout this loud and clear? Every coven, Every coven from the tree troubling trouble my destiny. Don't die, your mom, Dry up. 
with the tree and die. Every coven from the tree troubling my life. Dry up with the tree. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Aha! In Jesus' name we pray. Assigned to donate my joy to the enemy. Can you shout it loud? Run mad and die in the name of Jesus. My joy cannot be donated. Only fear your mitty. Yes, Benny. Oh, go on, go on, go on. Don't be, af don't be afraid. In Jesus' name we pray. Messengers of darkness. Bringing bad news to me. Can you shout it like fire? Die suddenly in the name of Jesus. Yes. Louder, louder, louder. Okay, bones, okay. That's why you are here. Corino, let's say believe by you. In Jesus' name we pray. Powers! I'm pushing blessings that are on the way to me. Powers! I'm pushing blessings that are on the way to me. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Let your voice be the loudest as you shout this loud and clear. Fact, it is a cry. Tie down my testimonies. Death. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Open your mouth and decree. In Jesus' name we pray. Pass! Concerning which doctors against me. Can you say it loud? What are you waiting for? In the name of Jesus. Let your voice be the loudest here. Jesus name we pray. Shout in my name. Don't keep your In the name of Jesus. 
Jesus. Ni oruko Jesus. This is a very serious matter. Oro patakili eleyi. Makaya bo shendera basa. Ribo ko ponda kaya bo shendera basa. In Jesus' name we pray. Pass! Assign to use me as a sacrifice. In the name of Jesus. Open that mouth, open that mouth, open that mouth. Yes. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Say this with anger. Arrows of arrow. And your far and one far. Not ordinary arrow. Kiss your far last song. Arrows of arrow. And your far and one far. Locate the head of my Goliath. In the name of Jesus. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Wild wind of God. Gather my enemies together. Scatter them in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and get them scattered. Why will of God gather my enemies together and scatter them in the name of Jesus? In Jesus' name we pray. Shout this with hatred. Holy hatred. Serpents. Gunning for my glory. Don't go me. Die by fire. In the name of Jesus. Kill the serpents gunning for your glory. Don't go Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Makatenda li loko poishende rabo sandiyala. In Jesus' name we pray. Ni oruko Jesus la badura. The next three prayers, I want you to be really violent to your spirit. Adura meta to ko imofe ke pinu jojo ni nwe. Say every battle. Bogogu. Arrange into my life to mock me. Can you shout with the boiling anger? Your voice is not loud enough. Back fire in the name of Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. So every power diverting my journey to stagnancy. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Jesus' name we pray. Dark strangers. Shout it loud. 
in the house of my life. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, in Jesus' name we pray. A seven fold man. Dark powers. Any battle operating in the day. Dark powers. Any battle operating at night. Can I hear you shouting that? Again, go and keep relaying. Shout it with anger. Against my life. Before I leave this place. In the name of Jesus. Name we pray. Father, Baba, I pronounce the curse of God upon any altar, any sacrifice, any priest walking against the progress of anyone here. I pronounce the curse of God upon them in the name of Jesus. Any altar prisoner in the service this morning be set free. 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 In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Father, we thank you for a time like this. And we thank you for the victory you have won for us today. Accept our thanks in the name of Jesus. The Lord blesses you from Zion. I make his face to shine upon you. And be precious unto you. All the prayer requests, O Lord, answer them by fire. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Every success of darkness over my life. Die in the name of Jesus. Every success of darkness over my life. Die in the name of Jesus. Every success of darkness over my life. Die in the name of Jesus. Every success of darkness over my life. Die in the name of Jesus. Every success of darkness over my life. Die in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So every evil hand upon my destiny. Wither in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand upon my destiny, wither in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand upon my destiny, wither in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand upon my destiny, wither in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand upon my destiny, wither in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand upon my destiny, wither in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand upon my destiny, wither in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So every spiritual wound in my body. Dry up in the name of Jesus. Every swish wound in my body. Dry up in the name of Jesus. Every swish wound in my body. Dry up in the name of Jesus. Every swish wound in my body. Dry up in the name of Jesus. Every swish wound in my body. Dry up in the name of Jesus. Dry up in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say so any kingdom caging my star. Release my star and scatter in the name of Jesus. Any kingdom can you my star, release my star and scatter in the name of Jesus. Any kingdom can you my star, release my star and scatter in the name of Jesus. Any kingdom can you my star, release my star and scatter in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So every sorrow provoking and writing be wiped off in the name of Jesus.
Every sorrow provoking and writing be wiped off in the name of Jesus. Every sorrow provoking and writing be wiped off in the name of Jesus. Every sorrow provoking and writing be wiped off in the name of Jesus. Every sorrow provoking and writing be wiped off in the name of Jesus. Every sorrow provoking and writing be wiped off in the name of Jesus. Every sorrow provoking and writing be wiped off in the name of Jesus. Be wiped off in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Can you say every battle I collected from my parents? I conquer you in the name of Jesus. Every battle I collected from my parents, I conquer you in the name of Jesus. Every battle I collected from my parents, I conquer you in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, my father, lay your hands upon my life. Anoint me with your power. My Father, lay your hands upon my life and let me with your power. My Father, lay your hands upon my life and let me with your power. My Father, lay your hands upon my life and let me with your power. My Father, lay your hands upon my life and let me with your power. In the name of Jesus, my Father, lay your hands upon my life and let me with your power. In the name of Jesus, my Father, lay your hands upon my life and let me with your power. In the name of Jesus, my Father, lay your hands upon my life. Life, and not with your power, and not with your power, and not with your power. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Every spiritual blockage tackling my life. Die in the name of Jesus. Every spiritual blockage tackling my life. Die in the name of Jesus. Every spiritual blockage tackling my life. Die in the name of Jesus. Die in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Oh God, arise and let my enemies be scattered. In the name of Jesus, O oh God, arise and let my enemies be scattered. In the name of Jesus, O oh God, arise and let my enemies be scattered. In the name of Jesus, O oh God, arise and let my enemies be scattered. In the name of Jesus, O oh God, arise and let your enemies be scattered. O oh God, arise and let your enemies be scattered. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, O oh God, arise and let my enemies be scattered. In the name of Jesus, O oh God, arise and let my enemies be scattered. In the name of Jesus, O oh God, arise and let my enemies be scattered. In the name of Jesus, O oh God, arise and let my enemies be scattered. In the name of Jesus, O oh God, arise and let my enemies be scattered. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Shout this loud and clear. Oh God, arise and let your enemies, my body, soul, and spirit be scattered in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and let your enemies, my body, soul, and spirit be scattered in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and let your enemies, my body, soul, and spirit be scattered in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and let your enemies, my body, soul, and spirit be scattered in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and let your enemies, my body, soul, and spirit be scattered in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and let your enemies, my body, soul, and spirit be scattered. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and let your enemies, my body, soul, and spirit be scattered. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and let your enemies, my body, soul, and spirit be scattered. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and let your enemies, my body, soul, and spirit be scattered. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, so, oh God, arise and let your enemies in my environment be scattered. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and let your enemies in my environment be scattered. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and let your enemies in my environment be scattered. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and let your enemies in my environment be scattered. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and let your enemies in my environment be scattered. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and let your enemies in my environment be scattered. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and let your enemies in my environment be scattered. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and let your enemies in my environment be scattered in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Can you now shout this loud and clear? Oh God, arise and let every pestilence be shifted away. In 
the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and let every pestilence be shifted away in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and let every pestilence be shifted away in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and let every pestilence be shifted away in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and let every pestilence be shifted away in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise and let every pestilence be shifted away in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say so sanitizing angels. Say. Cleanse our environment by fire in the name of Jesus. Sanitizing angels, cleanse our environment by fire in the name of Jesus. Sanitizing angels, cleanse our environment by fire in the name of Jesus. Sanitizing angels, cleanse our environment by fire in the name of Jesus. Sanitizing angels, cleanse our environment by fire in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. 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 Father. I speak to your life by the spirit of the prophets and by the power that disgraced Goliath. The powers that put error to shame by the power that sank Pharaoh that this year you will progress and prosper beyond your wildest imagination in the name of Jesus by the decree of heaven your life shall be plugged into the socket of divine favor in the name of Jesus and any power that does not want your existence they shall scatter unto pieces in the name of Jesus and by the oracles of the living God any dry bone in any life come alive now in the name of Jesus come alive come alive come alive come alive come alive come alive in the name of Jesus come alive in the name of Jesus let your amen be loudest in this declaration upon your life for the rest of this year your mouth shall be larger than the mouth of your enemies in the name of Jesus it's a wolf all day, man. And wherever they have been stealing from you, the lion of Judah shall roar and recover everything you have lost. And recover everything you have lost. And recover everything you have lost. You have lost. In the name of Jesus. By the power that divided the Red Sea. Any key the enemy has stolen from you. Recover your key in the name of Jesus. Recover it. Recover it. Recover it. Recover it. Recover it. Let your amen roar like thunder. Recover your key. Recover your key. Recover that key. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. By the power of El Shaddai. The problems that consume others shall not consume you in the name of Jesus. Any good thing swallowed by satanic serpents is vomited now in the name of Jesus. And every enemy that wants you in the grave they shall replace you in that grave in the name of Jesus. Let your amen roar like thunder. Any prison house confronting your destiny shall be scattered to pieces in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Every yoke troubling my family life. Pray in the name of Jesus
Jesus' name we pray. My family line. Can I hear you roaring like thunder? Hear the word of the Lord. Can you shout it loud? Receive deliverance in the name of Jesus. So every cycle of hardship in my family. Now somebody needs to shout this loud. Break! In the name of Jesus. Break the cycle. name we pray. Say, so, oh God, arise. Do a new thing in my family. In the name of Jesus. prayer. You need to get angry in the Holy Ghost before you pray them. And your voice needs to be the loudest here. Every gathering of ancient demons against my family. Can I hear everybody shouting this loud? Your voice is not loud enough. Scatter! In the name of Jesus. Command the garden to scatter. Name we pray. 
Say, stolen glory of my family. Come back now. In the name of Jesus. Overshadow my family. Thank you, Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Now say this with only violence. Collective captivity. of my father's house. Collective captivity of my mother's house. Can I hear you shouting those two things? What are you waiting for? Death! In the name of Jesus. your 12 prayer letters I've written now. Father, I thank you for your children who are celebrating their birthday this month. Let your power be upon their lives. Keep them standing by your power. Lay your hands upon them. And by this time, let them become bigger bundle of testimonies. In Jesus' name we pray. As you lay your hands on your stomach close to your belly button. And pray this prayer loud and clear. Every generational trouble in my family line disappear by fire in the name of Jesus. Jesus name we pray if you happen to this, this gathering and it is a desire that your children must marry and the enemy is trying to detain them from marrying find a way to the altar to stand in the gap for them now 
and pray this prayer loud and clear. You have been believing God that your children will marry. And the enemy has been causing delay. Find a way to this altar now. And can you sh shout this one loud and clear? Say, Gates of Brass. Bars of iron. Gates of brass. Bars of iron. Walking against my family. Break! In the name of Jesus. Bars of iron walking against my family. Break, break, break. In Jesus' name we pray. Every satanic and writing against my family. Dry up in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. I decree upon you at the altar that every power that does not want your children to marry before you leave this holy ground they are buried now in the name of Jesus. I said they are buried now in the name of Jesus. Shout a salvo for the man. Say every strange battle in my family. In the name of Jesus. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Now let your voice be the loudest here. Any shrine in my place of birth. Can you shout it with holy anger? <laughs> Attacking my family. Catch fire! In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 
thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Any pattern of failure in my family life, pray in the name of Jesus. name we pray. Raise your two hands to the heavenlies now. And let your amen roar like thunder. Father, I'm praying for your children who have attended this meeting. Let favor meet favor in their lives in the name of Jesus. Any unfriendly friend assigned to trouble your destiny they must be exposed and disgraced in the name of Jesus. Where the enemy wants them to forget you for good. They shall fail in the name of Jesus. All the efforts of your hardened enemies shall end in failure for them in the name of Jesus. The arrow of your God shall arise and trouble your troublers and trouble your troublers and trouble your troublers in the name of Jesus. Any wicked power running elter scatter with your name in evil places shall be disgraced in the name of Jesus. the kind of breakthroughs you have never experienced in your life. Receive that breakthrough in the name of Jesus. Receive it. 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 Let your amen roar like thunder. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. In the name of Jesus. The Lord shall use your lifting to disgrace your enemies. And this year you shall prosper exceedingly. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. I cover you with the blood of Jesus. The Lord blesses you from Zion. Make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. You shall go from strength to strength and from glory to glory. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. The sun will not smite you by day. Not the moon by night. Any power that wants to use any problem to kill you. Before you leave this place. The angels of war shall kill them in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. I decree upon your life over there that every curse that has hijacked your family history be broken now. In the name of Jesus. Every curse of infirmity, every spirit of infirmity, every curse of stagnancy, every spirit of stagnancy, every curse of frustration, every spirit of frustration, Every embargo of darkness, I command you to scatter now in the name of Jesus. Silence. I can see the hand of God moving from person to person. Yes. Every arrow of darkness in the body 
your time is up the ones in the eyes the ones in the head the one in the chest the one in the womb the one in the two legs arrows of darkness arrows of the enemy plantation of darkness plantation of the enemy hear the word of the lord it is written as soon as they hear of me they shall obey me strangers that submit themselves unto me the strangers shall be afraid and they shall flee out of their close places you the strangers in the close places get out now in the name of jesus silence at the count of seven from here all those who are in this garden and there is a rope of witchcraft around your waist they control you they drag you here and there when you are about to approach a breakthrough they apply the rope and pull you back i'm going to count seven from here the power of god is going to follow for such people and that yoke shall be broken forever one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The rope must be broken. The rope must be broken. The rope must be broken. Lay your right hand upon your head now. Lay your right hand upon your head. Father, I pray that the Holy Ghost fire will arise and kill every satanic deposit in anybody's head here. Anyone watching us, in the name of Jesus. Yes, the deposits have been troubled. It's time for them to go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's right. You are going to shout this seven times. Say, My head. Receive deliverance by fire. In the name of Jesus. Shout it seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Silence now. Check that head now. Check your body too. You brought some infirmities here. You brought some weaknesses here. And they have been shifted back to the camp of the enemy. And you can do what you could not do before. Find a way to the altar very quickly. Don't let the devil put any problem back. Now that it's gone, it's gone for good. Check your head, check your body, check that swelling, check your legs. Do what you could not do before. Run quickly to the altar here. If you cannot run, run. If you cannot walk, walk. If you cannot see, see. If you cannot hear, hear. In the name of Jesus. That's the power of God coming upon you. Aha. Lay, retain your hand upon your head. Say, Power of God. Attack all covens. Assign against my head. In the name of Jesus. Power of God. Attack all covens. Assign against my head. In the name of Jesus. Say three hot times. Now 
That's one. That's two. That's three. Amen. That's right. That's right. That's right. Something has been taken out from a woman's body. It's as if they put a heavy load upon your body. But right now, all those loads have been taken off. Check your body now and find a way to this altar. For the next few minutes, I want you to wear your warrior cap. This is the first meeting of the year. And there are prayers I want you to pray. There are plenty of prayers. But we have a short time to pray them. It will be a tragedy to keep quiet. It will be a tragedy to be left out. Can you shout this loud and clear? I break every spell. Upon my life. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to break it. In Jesus name we pray. Any witch dispatched to my house. I cut you off. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree that one too. Cut them off. In Jesus name we pray. Say so every power speaking failure to my destiny. You are a liar. Duh. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree that one too. Masepola kaya boshendera basanta. Jesus, then we pray. So powers chanting my name in darkness. Shut up. Da. Shut up. Da. In the name of Jesus. Powers chanting my name in darkness. Silence them. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. My stolen portions. Can you shout this loud? What are you doing in the valley of witchcraft? Can I hear you shouting that? Come on! Jesus yes in Jesus name we pray any sickness that wants to overtake my life can I hear the sisters here shouting? This? Sisters, your voice is not loud enough. Brothers, shout it louder than that. Everybody together now. No! In the name of Jesus. Something is going on over there. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Stretch your right hand towards this altar. 
Father, you have promised us that these signs shall follow them that believe. They shall lay their hands on the sick and the sick shall recover. Let the power of recovery, the power of resurrection, the power of breakthroughs. I enter into these hands in the name of Jesus. Let this hand become the hands of fire and power. In the name of Jesus. Now if you have any infirmity in any part of your body, smite the place aggressively. Don't feel sorry for the place. And you shout on it back to your sender. Back to your sender. Let's go! Do it well, do it well, do it well. Check your body now. That place is smooth. Check your body now. Begin to do what you cannot do. If you cannot walk, walk. If you cannot run, run. If you cannot see, see. If you have any swelling in your body, check it up. And run quickly to this altar. Don't let the devil put the problem back. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Say, I step into my wealthy place by fire. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and decree that want you. calendar of darkness if you don't want to repeat of any evil history this is the prayer to shout seriously calendar of darkness fashioned against my life catch fire in the name of Jesus calendar of darkness Jesus Jesus in Jesus name we pray I'm going to pray for some specific cases now if you have been healed please come out and talk now don't be ashamed. Don't let the devil put it back. They overcame him by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of their testimony. Thank you, Jesus. I'm going to pray for some specific cases. Silence everywhere. Don't say amen until I ask you to say amen. Father, I pray for that, your daughter over there. Some time ago, you were raped. The rapists were occultic people whatsoever they are planted into your body at that time I command them to begin to depart now uh, don't, don't say anything no. just keep quiet until I ask you to talk every plantation of darkness that has entered into your body through sex be released from it now in the name of Jesus that's the power Falling upon that person over there. Father, I pray that the power that used to pin this person lifelessly to the bed, 
as if your life is flying out. But Polly, I separate that power from your body now. In the name of Jesus, that is the power of God coming upon you. The power of God is about to come upon somebody. This is the problem. Your grandmother cursed you. Your grandfather also cursed you. That person over there, the power of God is coming upon you. And the evil spiritual garment upon your body is catching fire now. Yes, that's the person over there. Right there where you are. The evil eggs that that prophet gave you to swallow. Vomit them. 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 They have aroused your life for too long. Vomit them in the name of Jesus. Now, time for success prayers. Success prayers. Raise up your right hand to the heavens and say what I'm going to say after me. Say every altar of affliction raised against my success. Scatter in the name of Jesus. A loud amen. In the name of Jesus. Say so I break any power of non-achievement of my father's house in the name of Jesus say this year shall be one of my best years on earth in the name of Jesus because as from now I shall not labor in vain as from now men and women shall show me favor in the name of Jesus, a sevenfold amen. When I hear the sisters say, I say this after me. Warehouse in the waters. Can the sisters shout it louder? Sisters, I'm sure you can do a lot, lot better than that. Release my virtues. Can I hear the brothers shouting the same thing? That's right. Everybody together now. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to decree it. Jesus name we pray say marine witchcraft of my father's house your time is up Death. in the name of Jesus In Jesus' name we pray. I'm going to count seven from here. Anyone being controlled by powers from the waters, either mommy water, marine spirit, water spirit, they will be released instantly. The angels of warfare are scattered all over this place to cut every covenant that you have with them. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven. You can't hide. You've been hiding for years. Release our children. Release our husband. Release our wealth. Release it. Release it. In the name of Jesus. You marine husband. Lose your hold too. In the name of Jesus. Say this with boiling anger. Say, I release my wealth from the grip of marine bankers by the power in the blood of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree. Release them, release them. In Jesus' name we pray. Say so what I'm going to say after me. Say, so in faith, I hand over my battle to God. In faith, I come against every evil stronghold of any marine kingdom. In faith, I pollute your water with the blood of Jesus Christ. In faith, I overturn every marine agenda against me. In faith, I trample upon marine serpents and scorpions. In faith, I spoil marine palaces and set our captives free. There shall be no reinforcement or evil reunion of this power against me. I seal my confession with the blood of Jesus. And I cover myself with the blood of Jesus. Amen. A sevenfold amen. Introduce you to the atomic or nuclear power of the spiritual realm. In Philippians chapter 3. Verse 10. Philippians chapter 3, verse 10. That I may know him and the power of his resurrection and the fellowship of his sufferings be made conformable unto his death. Here was a prayer point prayed by Paul the Apostle. That I may know him. Two, that I may know the power of his resurrection. Keep that at the back of your mind. In Gospel according to St. John, John chapter 11, verse 25. John 11, 25. The Bible says, Jesus said unto her, I am the resurrection and the life. He that believeth in me, though he were dead, yet shall he live. He said, I am the resurrection and the life. Turn back to the first chapter of that John. John chapter 1. In the beginning was the word, and the word was God. And the word was God. The same was in the beginning with God. All things were made by him. All things were made by him. All things were made by him. And without him was not anything made that was made. In him was life. And the life was the light of man. And the light shined in darkness. And the darkness comprehended it not. 
the darkness could not just understand it. I pray for somebody that your life will be a mathematics the enemy cannot solve. The darkness cannot complain. The can you just understand it? In Colossians chapter 1, verse 16. Colossians chapter 1, verse 16. For by him were all things created that are in heaven, that are in earth, visible and invisible, whether they be thrones or dominions or principalities or powers. All things were created by him and for him. And he is before all things. And by him all things consist. By him all things consist. I hope you are noticing all these sweeping words. All things. No exception. All. All. No exception. Whether it's visible, whether it's invisible, whether they are throne, whether they are dominion, whether they are powers, everything. Ranging from your Bible to the air on your head. All things were created by him. Go right back to the Old Testament. In Ezekiel chapter 37. Ezekiel 37. Ezekiel chapter 37. From verse 1. The hand of the Lord was upon me. And carried me out in the spirit of the Lord. And set me down in the midst of the valley which was full of bones. And caused me to pass by them round about. And behold, there were very many in the open valley. And lo, they were very dry. And he said unto me, Son of man, can these bones live? And I answered, O oh Lord God, thou knowest. Again he said unto me, Prophesy unto these bones. And said unto them, O ye dry bones, hear the word of the Lord. Thus said the Lord God unto these bones, Behold, I will cause bread to enter into you, and ye shall live. Verse 7. So I prophesied as I was commanded. And as I prophesied, there was a noise. And behold, a shaking. And the bones came together, bone to bone. And when I behold, lo, the sinews and the flesh came upon them. And the skin covered them above. But there was no breath. Then said he unto me, Prophesy unto the wind. Prophesy, son of man. And said to the wind, Thus said the Lord God, Come from the four winds, O breath, and breathe unto this slain, that they may live. So I prophesied as he commanded me, and the breath came into them, and they lived, and stood upon their feet, an exceeding great army. A particular power entered into dry bones, and they lived. That particular power took the bones, put the flesh back on it, and breathed into their nostrils, and they lived. In Second Kings chapter thirteen, Second Kings chapter thirteen, look at verse twenty-one. Second Kings thirteen, verse twenty-one. And it came to pass, as they were burying a man. Behold, they spied a band of men. They cast the man into the sepulchre of Elijah. And when the man was let down and touched the bones of Elijah, he revived and stood on his feet. Connecting to the resurrection power. Beloved, there is a power known as the resurrection power. Again, this is another area of serious ignorance that many Christians don't know about. Paul, who had been born again for 30 years or more, prayed this prayer for him 30 years after conversion, that I may know him and the power of his resurrection. There is a power that creates. There is a power that energizes. There is a quickening power. There is a power that can make a life and can also kill. Most powers can kill, but they cannot make a life. Because it's easier to kill than to make a life. There is a voice that can speak to the dead and the dead will hear. Beloved, it is a lamentable tragedy. That there are many weapons in the word of God that we do not use or we don't know how to use or we are not aware of them. Our ignorance of these weapons is at our peril. Connecting to the resurrection power will certainly change your life. 
And that's what I'm introducing you to today. What is known as the resurrection power is the power that make it alive. The power that kill it without hands. The power that makes all things to consist. The power that changes dry bones. The power that speaks creative words. Creative words. A man got married for years. And he was looking for food of the womb. But they've gone to the hospital. The hospital said the man has zero sperm cows. And once they say that, it's only by divine intervention. Then the man came to a meeting. And in that meeting, the man of God quoted John chapter 1. In the beginning was the word. And the word was with God. And that word was God. All things, all things were made by him. Without him was nothing made that was made. Without him was nothing made that was made. The man of God now digressed for a few seconds. And said, this means God has every organ of the body in his warehouse. And that is capable of replacing the, any dead organ. Everything that the man of God said in the sermon, this man did not hear again. The one he just focused on. God has spare parts. God has spare parts. God has spare parts. God has spare parts. And when the man of God said, begin to pray, he laid his hands under his tummy and smote the place and prayed vigorously. Prayed vigorously. He prayed more painfully because a woman who lives across their flat, one day that there was a quarrel, you must say, shut up. Shut up. You did Mr. February. Mr. February. So, as he was praying there, you did Mr. February. You did Mr. February made him to pray more aggressively. By the next month, the wife became pregnant. I'm praying for somebody. Any organ that is not functioning well, or that is diseased, that the enemy has attacked, or that the enemy has removed, or that the enemy has defied, I decree right now that the resurrection power of the Lord Jesus Christ should fall upon that place in the name of Jesus. Receive that resurrection power. In the name of Jesus, receive it, 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 receive it. In the name of Jesus, a seven fold amen. What do we mean by the resurrection power? Is the power that accumulates fire within your bones is the power that destroys stagnation and eliminates decay is the power of though dead but yet speaketh is the power that brings the breath of life is the power that raises both physically dead and spiritually dead is the power that speaketh living words to dead things is the power that speaks words that matter on earth and matter in the grave. Is the power that arrests coughing spirits. Is the power that actually ensures our justification. Is the power that shows that Jesus Christ actually defeated death. Is the power that confirmed all this truth of the scripture. Is actually the power that differentiates Christianity from all other religions. There is no founder of any religion that rose from the dead. Is this power that gives Christians a living hope? Is the power that affirms all that Jesus said? Is the power that frees us from sin? Is the power that defeats Satan? Is the power that actually demonstrates the uniqueness of Christianity? Is the power that sustains life? What is the most powerful force in the universe today? Is it the power of electricity? No. Is it the power of a physical, nuclear, and atomic power? No. Is it the power of the waves? No. Is it the power of the wind? No. Is it the power of thunder and lightning? No. The most powerful force in this universe is the power of resurrection. Because it has the power to change lives. Changes people from death to life. It releases people from bondages. Revise people from coldness, physically and spiritually. 
the power of resurrection is the power I'm inviting you to connect to at this time. The resurrection power is a great and tremendous sign that God has said what he has to say and he will do everything he promised to do. It is the power that arrests the spirit of death and hell. I pray that tonight the ability to key into this power will fall upon you in the name of Jesus. It was many years ago at the press city. A woman was to deliver a baby. And by the time she got to the hospital, the nurse got confused. Everybody ran away. And they went and called the doctor. Meanwhile, this sister was already scared. She had prayed for that child for 11 years. And she fell into labor. Went to the hospital. And the first nurse to check didn't say anything. But ran away. Brought the matron. That one took him. Put the stethoscope. Check. Ran away. At that level, the sister was already crying. She knew there was a problem. So they brought in the doctor. The doctor too came, checked, and said, Madam, we can't hear the heartbeat. And he said, That's not the problem now. Is it heartbeat that is the problem? She didn't understand. He said, Madam, it means that the baby has stopped breathing. The baby is dead. Say, What? Dead? She's only crying. It's okay. Why is your husband? Why is your husband? Why is your husband? They called the husband. The husband came. And I told him, well, What do we do now? Can we evacuate the dead baby? The man said, No. We are going to press it. And they came when the power of Sinjans was on. And as the prayers went on that day, there was a word that we should form ourselves into a circle of five. But the woman was the first one in the circle. And the prayer they were to pray for anyone in the circle is that receive the resurrection power of the Lord Jesus Christ. They prayed. And as they left the circle, there was a word from the Lord that there is a pregnant woman in that circle. Your baby has come alive. And immediately, there was vibration. She ran back again. This time, not to the hospital, but to a Christian maternity home. And there she delivered the baby. When the baby came out, the baby was as black as charcoal. It was already dead. But by the power of that resurrection, the baby started, was breathing again. And now, I think the child has entered the secondary school. Now, what happened in that meeting? This power I'm asking you to connect to was what fell upon that woman. I'm praying for somebody that that resurrection power will fall upon you in the name of Jesus. That amen is not loud enough. Remember, we're talking about all things. Body, soul, spirit, business, finance. There is none that resurrection power will fall upon them and you will see a blossoming. Jesus was meek and gentle. However, sometimes it becomes loud and noisy. Jesus himself is that resurrection and the life. The resurrection part is not theology, it's a person. He said, I am that resurrection. Things can't remain still and quiet when the power of resurrection is manifested. The stillness and quietness of the cemetery will be disrupted once the power of resurrection appears. Jesus got to the tomb of Lazarus. He prayed to his father gently. He said, Father, I thank you. Because you always hear me. But by the time he turned to the tomb of Lazarus, the Bible said he cried in a loud voice, Lazarus! Comfort. And that young man had the voice of resurrection and came out. The spirit came back and reunited with his body. The resurrection power called Lazarus back to life. Anything the enemy has killed in the body of anyone today, in the life of anyone, the power of resurrection will bring them to life in the name of Jesus. Let out a man roar like thunder. How do you connect to this power? You are surrender your life to Jesus. 
Repent from all sins. Then learn to control and tame your tongue. Many of us talk too much. And so in the spirit realm, our words carry no power. Die to self. Receive the baptism of Holy Ghost and fire. Have violent faith. And pray the kind of living prayers we're going to start praying. So tonight, we're not here to play out a joke. Get yourself ready now. Bow down your heads where you are. Say, so, Pastor, I want to surrender my life to Jesus. Wherever you are, why all eyes are closed? Just see what I'm going to say after me. So, Father, in the name of Jesus, I come before you now. Lord Jesus, come into my life. Take control of my life. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Few minutes to pray many life changing prayers. Connecting to the resurrection power. I see destinies being restored. I see the yoke of delayed disappointment, stagnancy being broken. This is not a night to negotiate, like I told you. It's a night to strike when the iron is hot. Down resurrection power. Angels have just started work. I pray that Lord will strengthen you here tonight. I don't want you to go away from here. He said, "Can you shout this again loud and clear? Every coffin arrow, go back to your sender in the name of Jesus." name we pray. We are now getting into deep waters. This is an arena where <laughs> if you keep quiet, it is very unfortunate. Every dead good thing in my life. Can you shout this with only anger? For so many people here who can key into it. 
by the power of resurrection. It is my turn to laugh in the name of Jesus. Yes. name we pray. Now you need to be specific. If it's my body, say my body. If it's my career, say my career. If it's my marriage, say my marriage. You will shout this loud and clear. Power of resurrection! Blow upon my career! In the name of Jesus! Yes! Yes, yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Prayer number one. Say it after me too. I shall not be used as a sacrifice by the powers of darkness in the name of Jesus. I shall not be used as a sacrifice. Two. Vampire powers. Say it after me. Hear the word of the Lord. Drink your own blood. And eat your own flesh. In the name of Jesus. Prayer point number three. Harvest must meet harvest in my life in the name of Jesus. For my father, by your ordained prophet, preserve me this year. Five. My father, deliver me from every agenda of destiny impotence. In the name of Jesus, said my father. This is number six. Let the wickedness of the wicked expire. Number seven. Oh God, arise and always over answer my prayers this year. Can I hear somebody shouting that loud? Let your voice be louder than that. Eight. My body. Hear the word of the Lord. Reject infirmity. In the name of Jesus. Can you shout that loud? Nine. Famine and barrenness of the soul. I am not your candidate. In the name of Jesus. Ten. Let the resurrection power of the Lord Jesus Christ overshadow and surround me this year. Let the resurrection power of the Lord Jesus Christ overshadow and surround me this year. In the name of Jesus. 11. I shall not die but live to declare the works of Christ. The angel of death will not visit me this year in the name of Jesus. 12. 
The enemy will not contest my voice this year. The enemy has lost the enemy has lost the power to contest against me. 15. The son of my life. The son of my life. Shall not listen to the voice of witchcraft. In the name of Jesus. 14. God shall make the right people to help me at the right time in the right place. God shall make the right people to help me at the right time in the right place. Those are prayers for us personally. Prayers for Nigeria. Every enemy of peace in Nigeria or you can mention any country where you're in we bury you now in the name of Jesus. By the power of the God of Elijah, terror must bury terror this year. And the coven of terror must become desolate. In the name of Jesus. Three. Oh, glory of Nigeria. Do not slumber. Arise and shine. In the name of Jesus. Eighteen. Or number four. Oh, Prince of Peace. Reign in this country. In the name of Jesus. Number five. Let the wickedness of the wicked program to trouble this nation expire in the name of Jesus. And 20 is our regular prayer at Palm of St. John's. Oh God, arise and give us God fearing leaders. In the name of Jesus. 21. Or the last one, which is number 7. Lord, pass through the land in violent anger and slay the wicked who have made covenants with bad spirits to destroy. Those are seven prayers we should be praying for our nation. And the one for us to have mentioned them. My greatness. Hidden in the belly of the covens. Can I hear you shouting that loud? Jump out by fire. In the name of Jesus. Somebody is breaking through with that prayer of greatness. In Jesus' name we pray. I say, lady, you just pray that prayer. The Lord said, I should tell you that they are going to catapult you five levels forward. In your place of work. I congratulate you. We shall be waiting for your testimonies. Power, sir! Positioning me to the back. Can you shout with it only anger? Your time is up. The, in the name of Jesus. Any power that want to push me to the back. Jesus' name we pray.
So there is someone who just prayed that prayer. Tomorrow, this tomorrow, your promotion letter shall be released. Don't joke with the, these prayers. I told you, don't joke with them. Voices, Voices. saying, I will not go far. Sisters, are you here today? Can I hear you shouting it? All the students that are here, can I hear you shouting it loud? Let the brothers raise their voices like thunder. Expire! In the name of Jesus. If they say I will not go far, let them expire. Jesus, name we pray. I someone who just prayed that prayer. The Lord said, I should tell you the powers that keep removing your name from good list. That power has been buried now. Opportunity wasters. I am not your candidate. Duh! In the name of Jesus. Deal with the opportunity wasters. Makatenda na bosotonda yaba. Jesus name we pray. I someone here. The way you are going to know yourself is this. You are a medical doctor. But you are not practicing medicine anymore. The Lord said I should tell you that a great breakthrough that will rewrite your history is coming your way. Then that hand laid upon the brain of your child has been roasted by the fire of the Holy Ghost. Say power, sir! Troubling my glory. Power, sir! Troubling my star. Power, sir! Troubling my destiny. Can you shout those three things? You are not angry enough. Can you say it with anger? You are still not angry enough. Can you shout it now? Yes. Yes. Damn! In the name of Jesus. Bopata setenda kaya boshanda. Ribo sopole. So yes, continue, 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 continue. In Jesus' name we pray. What an insult. We're asking you to leave. You are saying you are the spirit of a grandmother. What an insult. Right there where you are. I set you ablaze. Let her go. Let her go. Let her go. There is the power of God coming upon you. Release her. Yes. I don't care whether you are a grandmother. Let her go.
Silence. Silence. Your wedding garment hidden in the waters. Repossess them now in the name of Jesus. It's happening. It's happening. Aha. I said, let her go. Just let her go. Say, serpents of my father's house. Serpents of my mother's house. They, in the name of Jesus. Yes, 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 yes. Jesus name we pray something is about to happen as we pray this next prayer say power son that want me to fail your time is up there in the name of Jesus I refuse to fail Bakate se tele ke ya bo shende la bo kapia. Riba se pole ke ya bo shenta. In Jesus name we pray. You are in this meeting. You have been taking particular examinations and you have been failing them. But the Pharaoh, the Goliath of that failure has been destroyed now in the name of Jesus. If you are that person, I count one to seven from here. Shout fire and smite your own head. If you are that person, shout fire and smite your own head. One. Do it well. Smite that head very well. Something is about to come out. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Yes. Three more prayers. Powers. Pushing me to the wrong people. To waste my greatness. Scatter. In the name of Jesus. Yes, sister, say it loud. That's right. That's why Jesus brought you here. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, arrows are signed to kill my greatness. Is that the loudest who can say it? Backfire! In the name of Jesus. 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 
Jesus' name we pray. This is number 10. Say every Red Sea. Separating me from my greatness. Can you shout that loud? Dry up! In the name of Jesus. name we pray. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Father, I thank you for your children who have gathered at this speaking into the womb of 2023 prophetic program. Father, I thank you for your mighty hand of power and strength upon them. Accept our thanks in the name of Jesus. As many as are gathered into this program, this year shall favor you in the name of Jesus. The Lord will open fresh doors of breakthroughs unto your life in the name of Jesus. Your breakthroughs shall surpass those you have had in the past in the name of Jesus. And any power hired against your greatness shall be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. The glory of God will fill your life from the top of your head to the sole of your feet. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Just remain where you are with your eyes closed. Focus your attention on Jesus as some angels are just moving in. They are here for assignments. They are here to uproot, to remove, to carry out surgeries, and to disband evil plantations. <laughs>